Boom, hello, welcome back to Dave in Real Life. God, this is, what, the fourth, fourth night straight live. Hello, shout out to everyone. Unbelievable. Oh, how are you all bearing up? Oh, apart from my back, which is shot to shit at the minute. And I think I've literally broke my back. So I'm in a little bit discomfort. Ah, you have to bear with me. I don't even know. Oh. Oh. There we go. Try and get comfy. Oh. You have to bear with me tonight. My back is proper feeling it. Oh. Anyway, hello. Uh, not much news to talk about. Obviously, only we can talk about last night, of course. Uh, but as far as like matches and that on Raw, there is nothing announced. It's all pretty much up in the air. Lots of surprises, though. Uh are scheduled for tonight uh, Adam Pearce saying uh, there could be quite a lot of unexpected stuff happening tonight so yeah obviously the first hour of Raw is also commercial free so X, I don't know what that means I don't know what we're getting so uh, yeah it should be uh, pretty good so shout outs to Rick Hunter Sports Horror Conspiracy Dylan, Jesse Jackhammer Cynthia hello shout out to you uh, yeah, hello everybody what's in the chat right now, thank you, uh, obviously it's been a fantastic weekend, we start a fresh new week, uh, man I am still not recovered at all, celebrating, Bailey's amazing win, she's up on the screen even though this is not her show, uh, but okay, wouldn't be surprised if we don't get an appearance from her tonight. Uh, Cynthia is in the middle of uh, making dinner, is anyone hungry? what is on the menu if it's a, a slice of your pie uh, then yes we're all uh, queuing up Cynthia <laughs> Leeds 2024 hello shout out to you ready for Ram Raw after Mania yeah Raw after Mania yeah this is the Paul Levesque Raw after Mania we didn't really get it last year I feel that it we're getting it this year I feel that really big Obviously, I heard a rumour today that Trick Williams, whoop, that Trick, could be making his debut on the main roster tonight. So, okay, honestly, get ready for that. Dave, my name isn't Cynthia. It's Wonder Woman. No, no, you can't be Wonder Woman. You can't be Wonder Woman. That's Bianca Belair. Sorry, cannot you cannot have her moniker. I will not allow it. Cannot allow it. Honestly, nope. Not allowed. It's it's only one person's nickname. We'll have to give you another nickname. What can we call it? Chat. We need a nickname for Cynthia. I eat Wonder Woman. <laughs> How are you anyway? Uh, hope everybody's well. Oh, crazy day. Crazy day. I've been with my mum most of the day, but we're going to be with my daughter all day tomorrow, so... Shaquin23, hello, shout out to you, yes, like, people, <laughs> straight in with the likes, love that, uh, but welcome Monday Night Raw, after Mania, we're all shattered, we're all tired, we're all, we're all pooped from Mania, I mean, honestly, Wrestlemania was, <sighs> Night 2 was just such an emotional affair, I mean, honestly, I don't even know if my eyes have recovered, <laughs> but, Honestly, we're here. We're we're back. Uh, I didn't have anything what stopped me from streaming, so we're we're good. Videos have done great today. Anybody watched the figure reveal video, which I get, went through my top ten figures from the weekend. I mean, there's a lot more figures to go through, but I just wanted to give you a little snippet of what out what is coming out soon. Heard that Dave is uh, late because he was watching Bailey's Factor WrestleMania night too. I was only like two minutes late, so there was uh, not much time in it. <laughs> now, uh, Streamlabs has decided to update, of which, if you know about OBS and its updates, then it usually <laughs> throws me off. This one didn't, but it just took a little bit longer than I anticipated. Stephen shouted to you, he said Liv Morgan was on the bump. Is she on her revenge tour? I mean, come on, that needs to start tonight. If we're serious about Liv Morgan, she needs to start attacking 
Rhea Ripley tonight. That needs to start happening now. We've passed away from, we've moved away from Becky. Becky's literally poorly anyway, so I can, I don't think we'll see her tonight. But if uh, Liv Morgan is uh, adamant on this revenge tour, she has got to strike tonight. It's got to happen. If it doesn't, then Liv Morgan, we might as well forget about her <laughs> as a character, as a wrestler, because she's been talking shit for the best part of a month. <laughs> So that needs to start tonight. If we're going to go anywhere with that, that needs to start now. Uh, obviously, Bronson Reed, uh, Andre, Battle Royal winner. What happens to him now? Where does he go? We've got Sami Zayn, the IC champ. Uh, oh, this is so much we could do tonight. Uh, we ain't even scraping the surface. Damien Priest as well. I feel like tonight will be judgment date heavy maybe Cody Rhodes heavy as well I like that WWE WWE haven't a, a brief show for tonight yeah there's no information whatsoever uh, that's why it made my unmissable video very hard to do uh, so I just had to do a kind of like a review on what happened yesterday uh, the Cody story and really go into that a little bit more and it did feel like top trumps I've got to admit it's like you started off with Cody Roman and then all of a sudden you've got Jimmy. So what do you do? Jimmy comes out, you top it with Jay and then poof, you come out with Rock comes out, you top that with... Uh, it was just like top trumps all the time. So James Chadwick, shout out to you. He just says it straight as it is. So, guys, uh, what do you want to talk about? <laughs> nice. And I'll say to that, let me talk to you. <laughs> oh, we love it, we love it honestly last night really cemented us guys as wrestling fans we really had a treat it looked like Paul Levesque has listened to us it felt like the world wrestling had literally listened to us and they gave us what we want they gave us everything that we wanted and uh, yeah, where do we go on from now Is that's the interesting part is we actually don't know we don't know what happens next. We haven't got a foggiest who's going to be challenging Cody. We don't know what's going to happen to Seth. Where does Drew go? Is he going straight into a feud with CM Punk? Or Damian Priest because he stole the championship away from him? It's just lots of stuff. Lots of moving parts. So it just makes Monday Night Raw just that little bit special. Uh, Cynthia, can we be, you can be my Wonder Woman. You can be my Wonder Woman. <laughs> no, Cynthia needs a new name. You can't have Wonder Woman. That is Bianca Belair. We can't do that. Can't share names. Uh, thank you, Rick. Uh, Cynthia, how are you doing tonight? I uh, heard that Dave was one of the mass. I was the one right next to Bailey's butt. I am not going to lie. I sniffed it. And it was gorgeous. <laughs> Yeah, I don't think she appreciated me biting it though. There's a bit where her face changes because I, I give it a little nibble. Right. Yeah, I don't think she liked that. I think there's a, a going to be a lawsuit. <laughs> I can't wait to find out who was the people in their mask though, who brought her out. I guess that would be quite interesting to see who, who, which future star carried Bailey's butt. Out to WrestleMania night two. <laughs> so yeah, on, honestly, there's not really a great deal. Obviously, the the main talking points was how great the main event was last night. Cody finishing the story. There's not really much what has been pretty much added to that. It's just lots of reactions from WWE superstars. Uh, I mean, lots uh, of lots of backstage stuff. The Caleb, uh, not the uh, Kathy Kelly and Dakota Kai was really good. You could hear Rhea Ripley screaming in the background. So there's just lots of good stuff. Uh, and what about the image, what was caught, of Roman and Paul Heyman having an embrace on the entrance? That, that seems really weird. But I feel that that's just the combination of the, how great this story has been. How great this ride for the last two years of the Bloodline story has literally been. Uh, 
I just feel like we've we've moved in out of the bloodline era now. I mean, it's we're still going to get the bloodline. I don't know what we get now because uh, I don't know if we see Roman for a bit. Rock is not scheduled for a while, so I don't know, man. Uh, the new era stats tonight. It does. Uh, Jordan Kirby, shout out to you. We are still Coach Cody Cry Babies. We'll never change, my friend. We will never change. Shout out to you, Jordan. Uh, last night was uh, special. Last night was unforgettable. Unfor it was unmissable. <laughs> uh, the game changing uh, pro wrestling and fucking love this shit. Nothing like on the planet that can grip you emotionally. That is, there's never a statement more truer than that. Uh, it pro wrestling announced itself last night. It literally just went. We never went away. We was always here. Uh, at WWE have been criticised many, many times of at this, and Paul Levesque has just literally said, "Yo, wait a minute. We've got the talent here. We can put on a wrestling show." And the entertainment part is the emotion, is that roller coaster, is yeah that you've got crowdy cry babies. I mean, The Rock when he came out for that with that, he knew what he was doing. He knew that was going to uh, get people's backs up. So, uh, you know what? It just works. Everything about it worked. At Wrestling Day's chats, they kept, kept saying, Watch Time Raw Stat. What? 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 I don't understand what that says. Uh, that's what I tweeted this afternoon. Very cool. Uh, Moldy Spoon, hey ho. Shout out to you. How you doing? Uh, yeah, I actually uh, was on uh, Facebook. And I saw a good friend of ours, uh, Jeff Watson, uh, the insider. Uh, he tweet, he like put an image of him and Cody Rhodes, him and his family, and Cody Rhodes. That was pretty cool. Uh, obviously, guys in America get to meet these wrestlers uh, quite easier than what we can here in the UK. But very cool seeing that he has met Cody, and he shared that picture on the social media. Thoughts on Bailey's film? I love it. Uh, yeah, I absolutely love it. She has now got her sights set on main event at Mania. She wants to main event Mania and have Paramore do her entrance. That is her goal. That is her mission. That is will will be what crowns her story. Her story is that. So yeah, Bailey's not done. That is how she will finish. So <laughs> get ready. I don't know if it happens next year. I mean, oh, just the story of Bailey. Did you hear it? The press conference. Apparently, all the females, and I mean all the females, went into Gorilla. And as she walked out, they all clapped and cheered. The biggest cheer ever for Bailey. Imagine that. I hope they filmed it. I hope some way ha uh, that they've got footage from that because I think that would be amazing. The fact that pa uh, Paul Levesque said that that happened. Bailey said that that happened. Well, Bailey is just one respected lady in that female locker room and all of WWE, to be fair. So it's such a great thing what happened. I like Steph's theme. It was the same lyrics, but more of a rocket instrument. Oh, yeah. Do, do we get Steph? Uh, do we get Stephanie tonight? Do we see Stephanie McMahon take a more visual role on Raw or SmackDown, whichever show? I mean,. I don't, I, I don't know if that was just a one-off but Paul Levesque like said it's just good to see her back looking radiant and full of life where she has been down in the dumps and all of this that and the other so yeah do, do we see more of Stephanie I don't know Cody deserves it he's been working hard since last year and the championship finally won it at WrestleMania it's not just his work I mean this is where proper wrestling comes in it's not just his work uh, since coming back to WWE. It's his work in general since he left as Stardust. The work that he did on the independence, the fact that he went over to, to New Japan, became part of the biggest faction in wrestling history, the Bullet Club. Uh, the fact that he became NWA champion. Now there's only four NWA WWE champions ever, and he's a part of that. It's just absolutely amazing. 
uh, when they have got you in the palm of their hands and they have completely hooked, that's when you know you're something special is happening. Yeah, uh, the Bloodline storyline, as much as people have hated the two year but plus reign of Roman Reigns, how great has that story been? Look at what we've had. Sami Zayn in a main event. That all Sami Zayn stuff was awesome. Uh, Cody's story, awesome. All because of Roman. And you always look at how great uh, the, the baby faces, but it's the heels what make the baby face great. Uh, and that's what we've had here. Is Roman has been the perfect heel. He has been the Ric Flair. He has been the Triple H. Any eel in history of pro wrestling, Roman has transcended that. You're supposed to hate him. You're supposed to boo him. And he's done that. He's worked that. He's found his niche. There is still that little rumour that he is going to get turned babyface. And The Rock is the heel. So I, I'm down for it. We will probably see that happen when they, whenever they return back to the ring. But that is, I think, where they're going to go down. That's kind of the road that they're looking to go down with that, I think. But seeing John Cena, seeing The Undertaker. I don't know what The Undertaker's role in all this is. Apparently, being the leader of the locker room is the reason why he was chosen to come out. I mean, who do you trump? The Rock. Who, other than Stone Cold, who trumps The Rock? It's The Undertaker, isn't it? And they know he's there. So it just made perfect sense. Oh, in G, Dave has been spotted. At, uh, somebody got a big, massive head of mine. <laughs> I'm coming out, boys. Uh, I am the big surprise. Uh, the best wrestling is when you can't even think. You're just like watching in awe. Moldy Spoon, yep. We watched, just as fans last night, we just watched every single bit as fans. We was gripped. We was enthralled. Every single bit of the story just took us on that next ride, uh, and you, just no, there was no words. You just, we were left like speechless. I don't, I, I'd like to think the next stories that we are told do the exact same thing, but we've just got to be patient now because we are starting new storylines, new rivalries. WrestleMania is done now. We're now pa making a path to the next pay per view and the next big show. The next. Cody's reign as champ. Who is he facing? Who is his challengers? Uh, it's not going to be Roman straight away. That'll be further down the line. It's not going to be The Rock straight away. That'll be further down the line. Who is his first challenger? Who is stepping up to say, Oi, Cody, that title's mine? Could it be Gunther? Could it be Bronson Reed? I mean, who do you do? Who do you push? Who do you push forward? I'd like to see a carry and cross Cody feud. It really elevate Carrion as a proper heel, proper badass heel. I kind of would like to see that. There's quite a few wrestlers where, that I would like to see pushed into that spot. I mean, yeah, it's put put in. Who would you have uh, Cody feud with first? I don't think Solo, but there is a storyline there with him always some always spiking Cody, I guess. But uh, I don't know. Uh, maybe even Finn Balor. Could we have a Cody Finn Balor feud? That could be interesting. Uh, Roman is underrated. Is uh, elevating everyone around him. Usos, Sammy, Cody. Who else has he elevated that many people whilst being on top? Yeah, that's what I mean. People don't see what he's done. Look at what he has done. Sami Zayn was not main eventing a pay-per-view before he got involved with the bloodline. Look what's happened. <laughs> you know, Ke Kevin Owens was do he was stuck in the mid-card. Look what happened. You know what I mean? Main event Jay Huso tag team wrestler look what happened to him it, it, and that's all through to Roman's reign as champion the bloodline has just done so much good work it's hard to ignore and it, I, I hope that in some way that we can continue it 
and keep this really good work going. Uh, the, the obviously we've got Jacob Batu come in, uh, he's going to join NXT, but he's a future uh, part of this Bloodline storyline. So we're, hopefully we can get to that in the near future. AEW are going to show Jack Perry. Yeah, I don't like this. I don't like it all. I think that is just sour grapes by AEW, and I think, I think to be quite honest with you, I think it's a shit way of getting publicity. I mean, what are they going to gain from it? I I couldn't give a fuck, right? To be quite honest with you, I've got, I'm not going to tune in just to watch some footage that will probably air on uh, X the next day anyway. Uh, I think it's sh shit. Uh, and if a WWE had done that about AEW, it'd, it'd been petty. People have gone, ah, it's petty. Uh, nah, fuck that. It, it just shows how low they will go to get views. And that that's a shit show for me. <coughs> Finn Balor or Cross, hopefully. Finn Balor's a good one. I'm glad I thought of it. I, mean, I only just thought of it while we were just like talking about it then. And I think Finn Balor would be perfect. Obviously, not Damien Priest because he's got the World Championship. Finn Balor going after the WWE Championship. I'm sure it's just going to be called the WWE Championship going forward. I don't think we're going to be calling it the Undisputed. WWE Universal blah 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 because it's too long winded WWE Championship is fine uh, hopefully we get some kind of wing he called a inspired belt but uh, we, that's just been hopeful uh, ok sorry my dinner is cooking I was can you smell what Cynthia is cooking <laughs> yeah you know, obviously it's uh, Serenity and mine is doing, but it doesn't. She doesn't like pork chops. <laughs> I was telling Irish earlier that uh, a lot of people were giving crap on Seth's entrance uh, for the Shield waist. Uh, and no, the setup was there. He said in a promo to Cody, "I will be your Shield," and he was. It played perfect. It was perfect symmetry. It was perfect storytelling. He was Cody Shield. At the time when Cody needed him, he potentially stopped Roman hitting him with the chair, which would have stopped any momentum of Cody, of course. But he didn't. He distracted Seth. Uh, he distracted Roman enough time for Cody to recover so that he could hit the three crossroads to get the victory. So now. Uh, the symmetry of that was perfect him being in shield retire attire called back to that promo when he said I will be your shield when you need me to be so no it was perfect spot on I'm glad he did it it seems like a, a desperate attempt a public yeah it is it's desperate mouldy and I don't like it I think it's desperation fuck AEW they suck they proper suck uh, both Royal Rumbles winners I think that's the first time it's ever happened, Chris. I'm, in fact, I'm not sure. I don't know if Seth or Becky did it, but I, I like to think that that was a... Did they do it at 35, Becky and... Yeah, I think they did, actually. I think Seth beat Brock. Becky won the triple threat. So it's been done before, but, yeah, it's very cool that Bailey and uh, Cody did it. Seth coming down as the shield he was uh, saying he was being Cody's shield distraction from the match to get Roman distracted the chair shot yeah S Cynthia got it yeah, uh, yeah people agreeing with Cynthia uh, Punk not in AEW anymore they uh, still need him to get <laughs> ratings grab yeah uh, see, it sucks it sucks man I think it's just poor and uh, if people are getting excited over this AEW thing uh, they're pathetic they really are because why why do you need to see it what are they going to gain oh because it makes CM Puck look bag bad no it just makes CM Puck like uh, an even more of a badass WWE should be playing on this I'd be like yeah man look at CM Punk he's not going to be messed around in the locker room yeah uh, I remember TNA doing something similar they used footage of WWE superstars because WWE were doing Royal Rumble and uh, I believe this was in Florida where uh, they was doing the uh, Impact Zone uh, 
and there was uh, Eddie Guerrero and I think it was Perry Saturn or some Dean Malenko was caught talking to TNA stars and they showed that footage on TNA Vince McMahon was furious because he didn't want them to have footage of his wrestlers so yeah I believe that TNA did something very similar back in the day uh, Perfect Shield Cody I agree with those who were crapping on him was wrong uh, and then Leeds agreed with me AEW is just like WCW uh, so if it leads, thank you uh, to see how we will no longer get six hour entrances. <laughs> WWE Women's Champion, first title for Bailey in five years. It's amazing, absolutely amazing. Uh, still don't quite know why we got the uh, Amazon entrance. She hasn't explained it, uh, but uh, still great though. She She looked awesome. Uh, Cody's only one and four people to hold. Yes, he is. Uh, that's a great fact. Uh, yeah, only four people ever to win NWA and the WWE Championship. It's amazing, isn't it? Only four. Who'd have thought that? Our truth has still got that opportunity to <laughs> bless him. We'll probably see our truth and uh, Miss tonight. <laughs> That'll be fun. Uh, their celebration. The 24-7-7-11 Tag Team Championship. Uh, Cynthia will get the six-hour entrance of Roman when he comes back in five years. I don't know how long he's away, to be quite honest with you. Uh, I don't know how long The Rock's going to be away. It's going to be very interesting, though, seeing ha uh, how far. Currently watching J bloody... Uh, was it? Oh, I wanted to call him Jack D. It's not. It's... Uh, Car, uh, why have I forgot his first name? It's not Alan Carr, it's the Alan. Uh, what? Why, why have I got his name wrong? I'm watching it and then I've got his name wrong. That is ridiculous, isn't it? Jimmy Carr is Jimmy Carr uncut. Jim ain't being funny uncut. Uh, you're probably watching Smackdown from last week. But that's what I'm watching. Uh, I want his, I want his mask to come, uh, come out with last night. Ah, oh, that mask what Cody was wearing. Fuck me. It's everything about last night. The entrances were on point. I mean, yeah, we didn't really get the big massive entrances night one, but we don't. Right. Uh. Cole Cough Crofter, Damian Priest will carry the title all the way to Glasgow where Drew will win the most rancherous, rancherous crowd in the world, Scottish crowds are phenomenal, shout out to Col. how are you doing mate hope you are well yeah I feel that that's where they're going to go with that obviously Gunther losing the IC title, we've got Berlin coming up as well so Gunther going for a world title in Berlin it's also going to be on the cards. Drew, it'll probably be Drew McIntyre versus Gunther in Berlin. So yeah, uh, we'll be building, we're selling stories, we're putting wrestlers in prime positions of their own towns, countries that they are from. We did that with Puerto Rico. Remember Selena Vega going up against Rhea Ripley. So we will do that. They, uh, obviously, uh, uh, Drew McIntyre, Scottish. Have him in the main event against Damian Priest. Perfect. Yeah, yeah, I get it. Oh, yeah, I'm all right, Cole. Cole, shout out to you, my friend. Hope you are well. Uh, yeah, obviously a lot of people uh, excited for tonight. Excited Raw after Mania. And it's Paul Beck Raw after Mania. Last year, we didn't get anything. It was poor. This year, there's a lot. There's a lot. Of anticipation of who comes up from NXT. Trick Williams is a name that I've heard muttered around the interweb. <sighs> Get ready, man. It's just going to be. Because there's no one matches announced tonight. Their first hour is no ads. <sighs> Mate, anything can happen. Anything can happen. Anybody could show up. Oh, hold your breath. We're going to be like. Cody's mask was worn, uh, well, was made by the same people what did the Bray mask. That's interesting. 
I uh, haven't heard anything else about my stepdad, Dave. Wished, yeah, all the thoughts and wishes and prayers for uh, Cynthia's stepdad. Obviously, uh, having a bit of a hard time at the moment. Uh, believe he's he's still in hospital, right? If he is, sh absolute shout out to him. Cole says hi, everyone. How you call? <laughs> uh, Raw after mania should be amazing. The crowd is going to be electric. It's going to be the same crowd. What was that mania last night? So they are buzzed already. They are. Cena. Expect Cena. I expect Undertaker. They're going to be there. Surely to God Cena's going to show up tonight. He's there. We know he's there. <laughs> I have had, have had more fun with two fake than watching last year's Raw after Mania. Yeah. yeah Raw's Mania last year was not great. Uh, I remember just like it being lacklustre. I don't even think we got any returns or any surprises on that show at all I can't remember it was just poor but th this year it's Paul of X baby I'm expecting big things expecting big things uh, Mick Foley has called off his last match for his 60th birthday after receiving concussion probably for the best yeah I don't think Mick Foley was in the right frame of mind to uh, making such a, a brave uh, announcement I think you should just retire, respect, be respectful, retire, and enjoy life as uh, just signing autographs and stuff. Dave, you know my name. <laughs> Expect Dave to be on Raw tonight. I am. I'm all over Raw tonight. I am everywhere. Anybody what's wearing a mask, that is me. I, I was all six of Bailey's carriers. <laughs> that was all me. I was the legs, I was a butt, I was the, even the guy holding her back up. <laughs> uh, Leeds, uh, and, uh, Leeds and Smackdown, especially if Bailey's going to be there. Riddle was the only surprise return last year after, or after Mania. <coughs> We've seen Braun Strowman, kind of, so that was interesting. Uh they always talk of Alexa but Alexa's might be saved because it, uh, I think they're going to her hometown soon uh, is she Cleveland like uh, Logan Paul I don't know uh, she, something like that anyway so I don't know if we see Alexa I, one thing I'm going to say and I'm expecting a vignette tonight Bo Dallas we have been seeing little teasers since the documentary last week we saw another tease at WWE World I don't know if we will see that exact tease tonight but I reckon we'll get a vignette Uncle Howdy Monday Night Raw just going to throw that out there uh, there's a lot of rumours about MJF showing up tonight but I really don't see it oh, look, look there was a stupid thing what I saw today about John Moxley being at Mania last night. I've not seen any photograph evidence of this, and we know Dustin Rhodes was there. We know that Ricky Starks was there. I don't know if John Moxley was there, but apparently he was. Read into that what you will. MGF, I I don't know, mate. I know obviously this is not on the roster page of AW blah, they've took him off the merch blah 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 that means absolutely fuck all in wrestling to be quite honest with you a card they used to do that with him all the time in New Japan but uh, imagine he comes out and confronts Cody that would be insane but I don't know man I don't I, if that was to happen I think the internet breaks <laughs> I think in I think X breaks and you'll see the end of AEW if that happens. I have to say how many uh, everything goes with my stepdad. I was planning to go to Illinois soon but might have to cancel it. Oh, well, all thoughts for your stepdad, my friend. Obviously, uh, much love and respect and support for you. If you need to talk about it, you know where I am. Uh, everybody who is in the chat what's not subscribed and not slapped a like on the stream, please do so. We've got 20 people in the chat. I'd like to see 20 likes, please. That would be much appreciated. 
yeah, obviously we are back. We're hopefully back tomorrow for NXT. If not, we're definitely back for SmackDown. So we ain't missing that. Uh, more like Dave shows up on WWE TV than MJF. Uh, Cole says, uh, problem with MJF that he is old school and he's constantly working. Everyone probably told AEW to take down his merch side. Yeah. It's, you've got to be careful what is a work and what is real. He he very much keeps the kayfabe. He very much uh, keeps in character when he's away from the ring. Uh, we've seen loads of videos of him telling fans to fuck off. <laughs> so yeah, I mean, and uh, being little kids at that. Uh, so we've seen it all before with him, so we know what we're getting. So I don't expect that at all, to be quite honest with you. We will see. I like how Dave put Bailey on the graphic. <laughs> yeah, Bailey's there. She's going to be there on every stream. Bailey's the new goat. I, I did cover up uh, Kevin Owens, who was no longer on Raw. So that's why she's there. You can see Seth's loving it. <laughs> Seth's like, <laughs> Wish your stepdad all the best, Cynthia. That's nice, call. Shout out to you. Uh, Leeds, we have more Dave than we did. As you see, we have more Dave than we did of Roman. Fourth night in a row. This is the fifth stream of this week, uh, of this weekend, and it's just not stopping. Uh, we got Jin freaking pig, ping. Is it ping? Jin freaking ping. Uh, hello, everyone. He says hello. How are you doing? I, 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 uh, I, I won't, don't want to say where you're from. But uh, Asian orientation, I would have thought. Southeast Asian, maybe. Which part, uh, uh, where are you from, dude? Jing Ping. Obviously, the freaking is like freaking, uh, freaking, uh, Jeff freaking Rollins. Kind of like it. Uh, like it up, people, says Shaquem. I don't even know where the likes are. See, McLean. Uh, it's WrestleMania Backlash coming up. It is. And that is from France. Palavu Francais. I don't know if that is what I've just said. I probably said I don't speak French. <laughs> Epic breaking news from Leeds. So, see, McLean, McLean uh, shout out to you. Hope you're well. Obviously, people are absolutely hyped for tonight. I, well, I welcome everyone what is new. Uh, quite welcome to the chat. Welcome to Dave in real life. We, we do watch alongs as much as possible. Just had an amazing WrestleMania weekend. Uh, honestly, blown away from it. My voice is going to struggle through this stream. I will tell, tell you that tomorrow. I don't even know if we do NXT tomorrow. If I'm feeling up to it, we will. The stream's up anyway. I have a picture of a cow. <laughs> and you don't ask what type of cow I was. Oh, you have a picture of a cow. Oh, right, okay. I, I can't really see the picture, to be fair. I, the the only reason why I said that Asian for the other guy it was because of Jin and Ping. <laughs> that sound like Asian names. But yeah, what 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 cow are you? <laughs> Cole, what kind of cow are you? Oh, I am so sorry, Cole. <laughs> I didn't even realise it was a cow. A brown cow, so Cynthia. Well done, Cynthia. It's a brown brown cow. But, uh that's a unusual spelling of McLean. It's McLean. I am Scottish. Uh, you were Scottish. I thought you were Scottish with the way that you said uh, Virgil McIntyre at the beginning. To be honest, I assumed. But you're saying Scottish people are loud. I thought, oh, he's Scottish then. <laughs> we are literally 15 minutes away. And I need to click over to the sports channel. we got to go, man. Monday Night Raw, first hour ad free big announcement 17 minutes away from pure cinema get your popcorn ready get your popcorn ready boys <laughs> and girls we've got LA night do we see green shirt guy again tonight I feel like we've had our full of green shirt guy new people welcome yeah anybody what's a uh, brand spanking new subscribe we do this all the time I'm a bit if I look tired I am tired <laughs> I like this stream people 
like the stream people oh Leeds is even doing it go on Leeds uh, Cole is Drew he's in the stream tonight yeah Drew McIntyre is here <laughs> mine's a Guinness that's not a very Scottish drink Guinness Cole you're letting Scotland down mate where's the special brew where's the special brew mate letting us down letting Scottish people down lad <laughs> meet date Cynthia <laughs> where's the special brew Ah, no, not as two Scotsmen in the chat now. We oh, are, man. <laughs> <coughs> Honestly, wait. We're going into this. Comp we're going into raw, raw. That's what, what, literally what we're doing. Call to all. It's doing raw live stream tonight. Of course, it is. Literally, everybody will be doing a raw, a, a raw stream tonight because it is raw after mania. People are expecting big things tonight. It's the Paula Beck era. Or as Paul Levesque likes to call it, the Cody Rhodes era, or the we era, the we era. It is us, the us era. <laughs> I loved Drew's tweet last night. Yeah, he, he, he backfired though, didn't it? Bored at work. And then, after the backlash, he just went, fuck. <laughs> and then, but the best thing about it, right, is that... Dijak also tweeted and said, well, we can say fuck now. <laughs> Love it. Dijak is the best. I don't go outside as much. Always stay at home, Cynthia. Give me this and a malt whiskey. Balances it out. There you go then. Cole's caught. He's brought it back. He's brought it back. And he also loves his iron blue and scotch eggs. I mean, ah, and his agus. And he wears it, sits around his house at home in his kilt. And he's uh, spotting. It's a proper stereotype here, and you've got ginger hair, aren't you, and a beard? <laughs> For freedom! Uh, let's lose £100 leads. I will get back to you. Uh, Dave, I don't do my WrestleMania for the results video because my dad is sick. Oh, no. Shout out to your dad. I hope he gets well. I mean, it, when you look like a monkey. I'm, <laughs> I'm only kidding, mate. I uh, hope your dad gets well. Uh, do it, yeah. Your dad, get your mum, get your mum to do it. Let's have a mum reveal. Bet she'd love to be in front of the camera. <laughs> it was hilarious that Drew tweeted that during the match. Yeah, he had his brother, his brother and his wife were there in the crowd. So, did you see them afterwards? They tweeted, "Oh fuck, fuck uh, WrestleMania," and they're like, like flipping, flipping it off outside. Proper cool. Yeah, Stephen says he's Scottish. Stephen, you're from Glasgow. Uh, I do too. Leeds, I don't go anywhere unless to the store. I'm only, I'm only joking. <coughs> People are so excited about tonight. It's so bloody epic. So I feel like this is one of the biggest raw streams we have done in a long time. Love it, love it. People just... Who do you want to see tonight is a question. Who do you want to see? Who do you think deserves that call up from NXT? Oh, who do you want to see return? Do we get who? Who? Matt Hardy is an interesting one. He's now a free agent. I mean, obviously, people go, "Oh, we can't just have Matt Hardy because." Uh, but why not? We've had Matt Hardy in singles before. Why can't we have Matt Hardy? He's a free agent. Would it be epic? Lols. He shows up tonight. I'm not too bothered about Jeff anyway because he's just like a, an old plus cause half the time anyway but I don't know man Matt Hardy broken anyone or woken I bet Cody will reveal it. yeah I think we're getting a f the first hour of Raw is ad free I expect we get the uh, title stripped down to being called the WWE title and a new championship <sighs> we're all praying it looks like the winged eagle, wing eagle, white strapped wing eagle. Oh, get ready if it looks like that. Cody opening the show uh, from the run she I saw. Could be interesting. He's got to open the show, hasn't he? See, it, it, we left Mania Night Two. His story has been complete. Well, not his story. We say his story, and it's not wasn't Cody's story. It was Dusty's story. It was never Cody's story. 
We made it Cody's story. It was Dusty Rhodes' story. That's now completed. Now we can go into Cody's story. So, yeah, I think people did get kind of lost in the lure of that. We were telling uh, Dusty's story, not Cody's. Uh, Besides, it's not what you look like. It's on the outside, it's inside. At least I think that way. Okay, Cynthia. <laughs> I want to see Dave on the Raw uh, debut. Uh, you are um, you are most welcome, uh, Jesse. C. McClang Clean says, WrestleMania Backlash. I can't wait to watch WrestleMania. Yeah, stop cursing, man. When are you going to stop cursing, man? Whoa! Why can I? Why, whoa, whoa! Honestly, read the description of this live stream, dude. We are non PG in the lives, my friend. We swear, and we swear when we want to. We, we that's how it is. I don't swear all the time, but if I think it, I want to swear, I'll swear. <laughs> non PG, mate. We don't do PG. It's just how it is. If I want to fucking swear. Yeah, no, it is. Uh, we, we're free. We're adults. We're adults. This is an adult stream. Uh, I do say this stream may contain uh, strong language. And I mean it. Because <laughs> if you want to be vocal, that's the way it goes. I mark out when we get something ba based on Wing Eagle. I think that has got to be the way to go. Because look at the design of the World Championship. It looks like the big gold. So it's we and uh, we we speculated ages ago once that title was uh, brought into prominence that the ring he got would be perfect and we were just waiting and it kind of made sense that it would be Cody. Cody brought back the uh, white strapped in a continental belt when he was dashing Cody Rhodes. He brought that back and all what it the Miz. It was one of them what brought that back. I felt it like it was Cody. But, yeah, we'll just have to wait and see. Irish Rebel, hello, shout out to you. You're not the final boss. You're the final foss. Wacka, wacka, wacka. You should go with that. Not the final boss, the final foss. Do it. That that was great. I actually liked it. Honestly, yeah. <laughs> Irish Rebel sent me, a, like, a promo thing on, in my DMs. Just joking around. And he goes, ah, oh, it's your final boss. It's your final foss. Wacka wacka wacka, you should do that. Do that. In your video, it'd be funny. Dot the back final boss, the final foss. Do that instead. Be way better. Don't tell us not to fucking swear. We can fucking swear if we want to. We're grown up ass fucking adults. <laughs> James straight in there and says it how it is. Irish Rebel Dream, the Dream Rebel, here's a special message to you. Wonder Woman! Cody tweeted a picture of the Wing Eagle the other day. It was uh, Cody that brought that classic into... It was, it was Cody. All right, I thought it was. Oh, I'm old. I'm old. I'm telling you now, I'm old. I don't remember as clearly as everybody else does. And, and half the time I make stuff up. <laughs> I, I mean, what I'm not going to make up is before we go live to Monday Night Raw, I'm going to quickly nip to the toilet. So I'm going to quickly go for a pee. I'll be back in two minutes. Entertain yourselves. I will be back in a few seconds.
we're back, we're back, we're back. Hello, you beautiful people. Uh, backlash. Next month, I want WrestleMania backlash next month, May. So bad, says C. McClang. Uh, I'm old too, mate. Uh, I'm, I'm, you know what? I, I don't really care how, but what people know my age. I am 46 years old. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> Uh, if you know me, Agent, I saw that picture, Col. It looked awesome. If someone says I can't swear, that just just keeps me swearing more and worse. <sighs> okay, I'm the final Foss boss, and don't you guys forget it. <laughs> and Stephen says he's 33 years old too. There you go. Col, what? Who is your favourite wrestler, dude? But obviously, I know Stephen will probably answer this as well. But see, he answers every question, which is cool. Uh, but what's your favourite wrestler? Who who is it? Is it Drew McIntyre? I, I reckon it's Drew. Uh, did, did it Cynthia? That is the title of my childhood. Actually, I need to pee and final floss before I <laughs> make cat cool. Same for you, Dave and Wonder Woman. Oh, it drives me crazy. Oh, it got. Oh my God, how do I say your name? Espanol, Spanish Rock. Queen. Uh, oh, I'm just going to call you the Spanish Rock. There, you are the Spanish Rock. <laughs> Final boss versus Stone Cold Steve Austin Rex Years WrestleMania. Ooh, question mark. Uh, exclamation mark. Hello, for Spanish Rock. How are you doing? I'm going to call you that because I'm not going to try and say your first name. Uh, my favourite wrestler is uh, CM Punk, says Stephen, of course. Uh, Ever right, shout out to you. I am so freaking exhausted. Drove around all day in Nashville asking Karen for her, taking Karen to her appointments and getting her meds. At least they bought her, she bought, she bought us dinner. I'm still tired. Ah, oh, shout out to you, Ever. I mean, we're all exhausted from last night's mania. My voice is still there. Of all time, or currently both. Cool. Both, mate. Both. Answer both. Simple. Uh, uh, Dave Bailey was awesome last night. She was. That was uh, one of my favourite matches of Bailey's. Uh, uh, just the story that they told. Oh, I just, you know what? I, keep her away from fucking Wonder Woman. That's all I ask. Keep her away from Wonder Woman. Just keep her away from her. I don't want to see Bianca Belair Bailey anytime soon. I know that Bianca will be going after the title. Shove Bianca on Raw with Rhea Ripley. That's what I want. Get her away from fucking Bailey. That's that's all I want right now. I don't want to see another series of matches between them two. I think Kenny Omega really, really think about leaving AEW. I think Kenny and Meg really think about leaving AEW with the uh, contract is up. Uh, he'll never go to AEW. He won't go to WWE. He'd have done it already if he was going to do it. it there's no way. He goes back to New Japan all day long. Uh, honestly, don't think I was going to make Raw last, uh, the Raw stream. Uh, just want to watch a Batman movie and go to bed. Do that then, mate. <laughs> so I don't mind. Uh, we don't force people to stay. If you were uh, you want to go and watch a Batman movie, that's completely fine. But ah, this Raw is unmissable. I I'm going to say it right now. We are three minutes away. Cr the the chat is on fire. Can't, can't, can't tell you how much I've loved the chat right now. It's 22 people watching. Thank you for all of you guys. Put likes on the stream for me, please. Much appreciated. Honestly, we look after our own on this channel. Uh, you guys are the pivot. You are the guys what run the show. I just read what you're saying and react. <laughs> so, yeah, please subscribe. Let's get this channel where it should be on top of the shop. It would be very much appreciated if we could do that. Well, we've got an extra subscriber, so shout out to that person who subscribed. I want to get to at least uh, 100, 550 by the end of this stream. 
I want to get to 600 or way past 600 by the end of the year it's, we're pushing it we're pushing this channel on as much as we can well no Dave I need to be here going uh, going into Raw doing live stream of Raw could mod there but decided not to oh you were uh, uh, the uh, going Raw team Raw, uh, going in Raw are they doing it I, I saw their reaction to uh the uh, Cody story. I right, there's a guy what does K fade reactions or something. He does the reactions from YouTubers and I want involved. They need to involve the little people. And I, I am outraged. <laughs> it's like they've got all the big YouTubers on there and I was like, What about the little guys? Wankers. <laughs> I put a like on your stream, mate, good Irish Rebel. Uh even if I'm not in your live stream I always drop in and like it. Also, put a like, please, and a thank you. Brett Hart, I was lucky enough to see Brett versus Owen in Glasgow at WrestleMania 10 Revenge Tour. Currently, probably Punk, uh, McIntyre, Owens. There are a lot of amazing talent right now. Oh, we're here, raw. We're going raw, guys. <laughs> ah, Yeah, Brett Hart is one of my favourites, dude. If you watch one of my videos, he's on the intro. <laughs> as long as with Bailey and LA Knight. <laughs> Like it up, ever just so you know. Insiders not doing TNA this week, taking some time off. Here we go. This I love this intro. Oh, I need. I want. I need to get this recorded and do a breakdown of who's actually in the intro. Because I saw Bruno San Martino. In fact, every time I see it, I see new people. That intro is bloody gorgeous. Then now forever intro is amazing. I love, I love it. Revy Marvel S. Do, 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 do. It's time to play the game. It's Triple H. What's coming out first? It's Paul Avec era. Ooh, oh. oh yes. Obviously we're in the same venue as we were for SmackDown and the Hall of Fame, but it is Triple H. What is coming down? Is going to invite Cody down, isn't he? Here is Trips. Triple H. OMG. What's with the Doctor Strange intro? <laughs> and the fight Foss Boss. Interesting. Oh, look at him. I love this with the little kids. Ah, so good, man. So good. Welcome to Monday night. This is the... The new era of pro wrestling. This is the Paul Avec era. Are you ready? I said, Are you ready? <laughs> We're not ready. Not ready at all. Watching uh, Sky TV is so. Let let me know if you're spoiling anything because it's usually ahead by a good bit. All oh, right. Okay. Right, well, we're watching it on Vir I'm on uh, Virgin Media, TNT. D right, all I can say with that then, Cole, be mindful of what you put in the chat. If you think that you are ahead, just try and just like try and feel the room uh, when you're putting something in. Dave, I'm a simp boss. <laughs> I think we see Liv Morgan tonight. You've got we've got to see Liv Morgan tonight. So Triple H is kicking off the show. I'm going to change that round. Because we, we know it's a watch along now, don't we? we? We know it's a watch along. Philadelphia, we are live. I feel like we've seen a lot of Philly. Oh, we've seen way too much Philly. I was watching Grimm. And he was only at night one. Grimm's toy show. And it was really good. Get a real feel of the crowd. I'm just going to call him Triple H. I'm not going to call him Paul Levesque. Triple H. He's going to call out Cody. The Triple H. There we go. Are you ready? Green shirt guy in front row as he has been all weekend. Uh, he wasn't at stand and deliver though. But he's there. He's got blue shirt guy at the side of him. Look at this crowd. Raw after mania crowd. Triple H. Sit drinking in, man.
Thank you, Hunter, he's been chanted. Yeah, because we've been spoilt. <laughs> I feel like we're, he's not over yet. Look at him. Sinking it in. Loving it. Here's the thing. I came out here to thank you, he says. Honestly. Crap. Every year Triple H gets a new new Latin catchphrase I've got to I've got to translate. <laughs> oh yeah, it's the uh, thing at the ring entrance, wasn't it? Biggest WrestleMania ever. And that's from the words of Triple H. Damn, I'm I'm ahead by like a minute. I'll stay quiet. <laughs> yeah, we just got Paul Levesque on the screen at the minute. Just, just, just be careful. You <coughs> <coughs> just welcomed us to Monday Night Raw. Suck it, Vince. Welcome to a new era. Cody. W what? Wiley Willy. So, this, it, so, it's not a watch along. What do you mean? It is a watch along. <laughs> Hello, Wiley Willy. How are you doing? Why, why, why is it not a watch along? What do you mean not a watch along? What the, a watch along is literally what we're doing. <laughs> so it's not a watch along. Here comes Cody, your new universe, uh, undisputed WWE Universal blah 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 champion. <laughs> Hopefully we change that name. Adrenaline in my soul. Something, something, Cody Rhodes. There we go. That's my song for you guys, because I, I love you. There we go. Cody's on his way with the championship. Undisputed WWE champ, Universal champ. Oh, God, it's too much of a mouthful. <laughs> Wiley, Willie, misunderstanding, lol, thought it was streamed. <laughs> Now we are live, my friend. It, the uh, Raw is live right now. And we're watching it. Right now. Uh, I love the uh, minimal stage. It just makes it look much bigger. Yeah, this is what we got treated to on Smackdown as well. Look at all the phones. All of this stuff going out on social media. <laughs> Nothing's missed. You deserve it. Ch -ch -ch. He does, man. His story has been epic. And it's... Oh, look at the guy in the suit there. And he's just giving the too sweet. And they never do the too sweet. But the guy in the suit's awesome. And somebody in a Cody, like, jacket. What he's probably made himself. Oh, it's probably the merch jacket, isn't it? Here he is. Look at Cody. Oh, there's the fireworks. Well, we didn't get to see the fireworks, but we heard them. Look at that belt. Is there a new belt? Oh, he's got the side plates. The side plates are on there. The Cody side plates. That's interesting. WWE Universe. What do you want to talk about? <laughs> does look good on him right it does look good on him we saw that handshake last night which was for kind of forced because Triple H didn't actually want to come out to the ring there he is your champion the WWE well the undisputed WWE universe oh my god it's too much it is too much. Come on. Cody. First thing I want to hear out of Cody's mouth other than his catchphrases 
Yeah, we're not calling it that anymore. <laughs> so yeah, I was switching to my computer, had to uh, charge my phone. No worries, dude. Side plates tell me no new title tonight. Yeah, that's what I just saw. The side look, he's even pointing out the side plates. He just pointed at the side plates. So yeah, I'm not. That that kind of sucks. I'm not happy about that, but we'll wait. We'll calm it down. We'll wait. <laughs> Maybe later. Cody, Cody. There he is, your champ. Yeah, your true final boss, guys. Fi I love it because finally. <laughs> but he's not going to go. You deserve it, champs. Oh. Hijacking the show as they always used to do. Raw after Mania, the fans are hijacking the show. Honestly, drink it in, man. Drink it in. Looks so good. Look at the smile on his face. The smile tells it all. Congratulations. Dave, there's a personal story that I think you will enjoy. But for another day. Okay, Cynthia. If it's more lessons from your friend... Then please share. <laughs> please tell me the Rock ain't gonna come out and revoke Cody's win. No, no. If that were to happen, I think the, I think everybody would just leave WWE. Attendance gate record. Over 20,000 people in this arena tonight, breaking the attendance and gate record for WWE event. Wow. True needle mover. Yes, true needle mover. Already way more atmosphere than the last two years, yeah. <laughs> Vince McMahon lost his touch, didn't he? Oh, fucking wanker. Triple H called Cody undisputed WWE champion. Oh, he missed out the universe. Oh my god. Hope not ever. At the crowd at Raw after Mania, usually electric because of the crowd at Brits. <laughs> yeah. You, it is correct. That is actually true. I can't revoke Cody's win because Triple H is in the ring, Dave. I, I, I didn't say it. That was Heather's statement, not mine. <laughs> It is, look at the oh look at the video oh, the screen what they've got the screen's around the ring so this is interesting it's so that Cody can see the video package rise up by Andrea Day yes he was on the TV show earlier on today wasn't he the Cody story Roman, uh, Cody Rhodes, the face of WWE Irish already knows of two stories I told him and he enjoyed them <laughs> isn't that right Irish oh my bad Dave <laughs> could I say I'm only reading the chat mate I'm reading what your guys are saying it's not my my opinion look at this video package it is awesome St I am still your final FOSS boss <laughs> I, I'm not gonna cry. I'm not gonna cry. I'm not gonna cry. Damn these allergies. Damn these goddamn allergies. Look at Brandy. Oh, look at Cody. He's getting uh, emotion in the crowd. I mean, it's oh man. Just show him Dusty. Just show him his dad, and he's gonna he's gonna blub it. Look. Oh, look. Oh man, F fuck off. Fuck off. Ah. No, I don't want to see him cry, man. No, not again. Not like last night. No, not again. Come on, not twice. <coughs> <coughs> oh, don't know if I can cope. 
why we love wrestling guys this is why we fucking invest our time our effort us Brits especially when we're up at one o'clock in the fucking morning watching this shit and people are looking at us going you're an idiot for liking pro wrestling this is why we like pro wrestling this is why we love pro wrestling that's why us Brits stay up this is why we invest our time our effort shit like this tell me I'm mad and I tell you you're mad still prefer Cody with the dark hair sorry not sorry uh, Samantha Irving's voice breaking while calling Cody whilst the winner last night nearly broke me man seeing the video have you seen the video they filmed her oh her face a crying face oh my god it's like ah. David was so emotional last night mate uh, that how someone it it was to me how awesome it was to me this is emotional yeah this I don't want to get emotional that's why I'm trying to distract myself just everything about that video package oh the kid his kid there's his dad ah, waterfall and there's Cody <laughs> that storytelling that is storytelling that is parallels that is how you work history of pro wrestling to modern day wrestling <laughs> amazing <laughs> amazing 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 <sighs> man somebody said pass me the tissue I say here you go <laughs> Uh, I know it was so emotional I'm still feeling it from yesterday uh, her voice last night made me cry just hearing how happy she was for him same with Sammy's win you deserve it chance this is just raw man because this is not about entertainment this is not about just the storytelling blah 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 this is personal shit this is literally personal this is about a legacy Something that his dad never got to do. He's now can live. His da dad can live vicariously through this. Oh, he's laying the belt onto the floor. He's going to kiss it. Ah, one good thing about this, there's no prime bottle on the uh, floor when he's done this. So that's good. Right night to do it. I think it was so emotional last night. But partly to do with the Vince shit. And all the bullshit that's pos su suddenly been going on, on bullying and etc. It was everyone's official moving on. Uh, that's my take, at least. That's a cool take to have, Cole. Very cool. Now let me talk to you. What do you want to talk about? Uh, something is good to be true. It usually is. When something is too good to be true, it usually is. I wonder if Seth will come out during this speech. Chris says new NXT female champion Roxanne Perez makes her debut Raw tonight does she spoilers no prime yes <laughs> you deserve it I knew what I wanted to talk about Oh, he's pinching Sam. Oh. <laughs> Look at her, she's best out laughing. Oh. Oh, he's going to get her to call. Oh. For you, yeah. Oh. I'm telling you this this is easy like Darth Vader level too easy speed make oh don't say speed coming back fuck that prick uh, uh, Roxanne Perez faces Indy Artwell tonight Chris let us just enjoy let us enjoy we don't need is that on Twitter Let's enjoy it, man. 
don't want to know. No more matches announced, please, in the chat. Let's just enjoy the show. Let them surprise us, not us surprise us. Thirty-nine feet. The altitude in Philadelphia is thirty-nine feet above sea level. They're standing on top of the mountain. Love it. I love it when they work promos like this. Very dusty-esque. I hate all these idiots like KSI Speed. I just got to admit Logan Paul is fucking natural, not not wrestling fan. I can't deny that, but he has it all. Yeah, I, I've actually grown to like Logan Paul as a wrestler, well, sports entertainer. I don't like Speed. I, KSI, mm, I could take it or leave it. I, I, it's annoying YouTubers. <laughs> That was goddamn annoying YouTubers, <laughs> says the YouTuber. Uh, but yeah, they're, they're great on me. It's the fan base that also greats on me as well. Uh, yes, let's enjoy the show because your boss, boss says so. Thank you, Roman. It's good that he gets acknowledged. There's your acknowledgement, Roman Reigns. Got to remember that what where, where a good baby face has an excellent heel. But uh, true tribal chief for sure. Hell yeah. <coughs> <coughs> So the big thing that you get asked when you go into sports entertainment or wrestling is the why. Why are you sacrificing? What What's your end goal? Why are you there? Cynthia just lowers the tone. You could be my final boss. Oh, look at this little. Is that his daughter? Finish his daughter. Oh, it's not his is it daughter finish this story cute that's his daughter <laughs> papa doesn't go to work he goes to work in the main event Bappa is fighting. Oh, it's good, man. Don't care. 22 minutes into Raw, and it, oh, this is so good. Dave, don't start tonight. <laughs> it's you what started. Cynthia. Look at you, floozy. Am I kidding? Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Cody Rhodes. <laughs> undesirable. Was undesirable come undeniable. And now, undisputed. Oh. So there you go, easy now credit the title as the Undisputed Universal WWE Championship. Oh, too many names. Oh, The Rock is here. The Rock is here. The Rock, the people's champ. Shush. Dave, shush. Rock is here. Oh, what the fuck? Uh oh. Dwayne, it's Dwayne. Dwayne is here. Hello, Dwayne. The final boss. He hasn't left. We thought he'd left. He hasn't left. He's still here. 
Oh, sticking his R in. Boo, Barack. <laughs> Can't let Cody finish his bloody story. Has to get involved. Ever goes, called it. Oh, surely to God they can't revoke. Surely to God. Don't you dare rock. Oh no, the rock is here. It's Dwayne. I don't know why anybody just doesn't call him Dwayne. Because I would be like, what Dwayne? <laughs> Dwayne Dibley from uh, uh, Red Dwarf. If you know, you know. <laughs> Hello, Dwayne. So the rock has shown up. Party pooper rock. Setting up a feud, we did ask what kind of feud would Cody have? Is it The Rock next? The so called final boss? How does The Rock step down? Oh god, fuck knows. It's The Fucking Rock. It's Hollywood Rock. Why is Dwayne carrying a toy title? That means nothing in WWE. It's like different. It's like. It's no different to me going to Tesco and carrying a replica belt. <laughs> somebody should cash in on that championship I remember Day saying it uh, somebody cashing in on that uh, Damien Priest cashes in on that title <laughs> can't do it now because there's nobody to cash in but The Rock is here the people's champ the people's chump struggling to get in the ring though old man uh, told you the rock is going to screw Cody like Vince did to Dusty. Yeah, but all the hype and all the stuff that they've been doing, it's not an it's not an official title. No, it isn't call it is not. It's just one what was installed on him by Muhammad Ali's widowed wife. It's more of a personal thing. He promised. He never, never gave the bloody belt to Mama Rose. <laughs> Here we go. The most electrifying man in all sports entertainment. Getting in the grill of the the new champ. We're getting Rocky chance, final boss sign. I am the Foss Boss Champion. <laughs> oh, we will. Here we are, we're here at this summit. Thought Rock might have had enough. Uh, didn't the dead man take you out last night? Ha! Lol. Rocky told Seth he could strip of the heavyweight champions because he's the boss. This could be interesting. Hmm. Undertaker. <laughs> Undertaker chance. Oh, you've got to love this crowd. Undertaker. <laughs> you got taken out by a dead man. I'm the simp champion, says uh, Jesse. Oh, man, this is already good. This is already a clip to what we thought was going to happen tonight. You passed the test. Surely, they should. That should be what he should say, right? But it's not. Rocky, come on! Don't let us down. Don't be the idiot. Oh, somebody shouted something at him, which he did not like. God, I hope he will leave Cody alone. Leave him alone. Leave him alone. God damn it! Rocky sucks. Chance now. Cody's like, oh my god, where's this coming from? I come out here to uh, do something good. <laughs> I see though, we don't know. We're scared. Now this is true Raw After Mania crowd, yeah. Undertake. <laughs> crowd taking over, love it. Dave, the look on Rock's face last night is the the booing him like <laughs> they're literally booing him like Dominic. They're booing him like Dominic. It's pri yeah, it's priceless, man. This is Dominic level boo. Not letting him talk. 
all the crowdy cry babies. Gotta love it. This crowd is electric. Shut the fuck up is what they're shouting at him now. Shut the fuck up. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> Pat McAvee is shouting, that's your final boss, Philly. Oh, this has gone south pretty quick. Let me tell you. Rocky's so trying. He's so trying to get his words out. <coughs> now the rock says he's shouting into the mic, he's getting frustrated. I would have to say The Rock is good entertainer though. Rocky Sucks is not one of them. Sure when they rehearsed this they wasn't expecting this crowd reaction. Calling him an arsehole now. Oh, dear, this is just lols. I feel that the British crowd has had a massive influence on America. I am so sorry. You started the swearing though, final boss. You started it. You brought wrestling uh, swearing back into wrestling. I agree, legend, goat for sure. Final boss rock is fucking brilliant. This is a version of the rock we need, yep. Now, before we begin. <coughs> He's getting what chance? Rock has come out to give Cody his flowers. Trailer Park Trash. Yay! And the crowd love it. <laughs> the crowd are literally just up on the feet going, yeah, we are trash, so what? We don't give a fuck. Pat McAfee's up on his feet. Shut the, f shut the fuck up. <laughs> Rock swear and it gets cancelled out by uh, the network. <laughs> the Rock is, uh, is the get the Dom treatment. These uh, these boos, yeah, yeah. Oh my God, this crowd is so good. Ah oh, man, oh, don't need any wrestling tonight. We'll just have three hours of this. Three hours of this. We're done. We don't need any wrestling tonight. We don't need. Anything else tonight, we're done. Guys, we're done. Cody just don't at the championship to massive cheers. It's something I can't watch, but so Dave is the voice of the show. Yeah, it's electric. The crowd are absolutely fucking electric. I am for Foss Boss Dud Muffin. <laughs> Rocky's fake title looks like a wing eagle slightly. Yeah, he is uh, quite that, but he's put his title up and the people are just booing. It's not got the same effect. Take the bull out of the middle. You've got the wing deedle, wing eagle to belt. It's a nice belt though. It is lovely. I, I reckon it'll sell well on the WWE shop. The rock came out here. No fireworks. No blood being spilled. Just you and me. Cody Rhodes, you did it. You could, they can chant what they want, but this is between you and the Rock. Uh huh. 
Is this genuine? I, I, I want to feel that this is genuine. That sucks. Are you in the UK? I don't have cable. Now, she's from uh, Kentucky. My special belt, I whooped you like a dog. I'll put that special name on that belt, Mama Rhodes. I can't watch after the show is I can watch it after the show is over. <laughs> Go on. Your daddy never had a big smile on his face. Rock try I don't know. I don't know what we're getting here. Is this a genuine moment with the Rock and Cody? A passing of the torch maybe? Don't know. Or is this just leading us down a garden path? Your daddy was my hero, man. So, man, his dad, your dad, we were good. They were good friends. Irish rebel. What's the crack? <laughs> Uh, I am thinking of getting you uh, YouTube TV might be able to watch it if I can get it this is good man I don't care how long this has taken Rick Hunter I want to knock out the rock and steal his title <laughs> RW, RWL for life baby Said the title's beautiful. Get the new nameplate on it. Side plates. Yeah, I say, I know you said the belt is fake, but this was given me to be by uh, Muhammad Ali's widow. The people's champion. Okay. Is there any way The Rock can hold that title? That's a, a nice question, isn't it? Final boss, Cody versus Rock. Summer Slam, anyone? Lola, hello. Hello, Lola. Lola. La 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 la. Hello, shout out to you. Been a while. How you doing, my friend? He's never held that one. So Rock is kind of making official play for the undisputed Universal WWE Champion. Oh God, I fucking hate that name. Blah 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 belt. Win a Royal Rumble, then rock your tit. Well, I won a Royal Rumble and got a chance to face the champion. Jay Yeet. <laughs> That's what I'd say, Cody. If I were Cody, I'd go win the Royal Rumble. I won it twice. Oh, title versus a title. Oh. No, 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 Cody. Is it just them just passing the belts? What the fuck is this all about? They're going to hand... This, this, this is all they meant, is just holding each other's title. What? It's not actually going to be... Well, okay. Cody's unsure. Can I hold your belt? Can I hold your belt, please? I want to hold your belt. He runs away with it. <laughs> have a look. It's nice, isn't it? I'll have a look at yours. Rock's fancying the belt. I'd hit Rock with his belt right now. Take him out. <laughs> Rock. 
Rock carrying it as if he's the champion. Oh, it's old Walt. Oh, I've got the title. Don't look at me, I'm champion. Oh, it kind of feels right, says The Rock. In symbolic, because he's kind of saying that Cody's the people's champ, not the real champ. That's pretty much what he's saying. That's the implications here. I hate that I'm ahead. You know what's happening, don't you, Cole? Swine. <laughs> uh, Dave, you can haul my universal title anytime. This is awkward, chance. Oh, is it? This is awkward. Dave, you hold my universal title anytime. You say all the nice words, don't you, Irish Rebel? You say all the nice words. Rock made it cool. You rock made it cool. Na 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 na. Hey hey hey. Goodbye. Na na. Sing it with me, guys. You know the words. Hey hey hey. Goodbye. We in Montreal or what? Na 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 na. Hey hey. <laughs> love it. Love it. Love it. He's not gonna. He's gonna rock bo bottom flipping Cody in it. Summit's gonna go down. Summit's got to go down. Oh, is he just gonna leave? So when Rock comes back, he's coming back for Cody. SummerSlam, Rock versus Cody. I'm gonna call it here right now. That is what we're gonna get. I'm going to look forward to it, says Cody. However, Rock calling back to the night one where he pinned Cody one two three in the middle of the ring. It's good storytelling, and it's right. Rock did not get pinned. SummerSlam, Cody Rock. Oh, hottest show of the year. Hello. We want it. We've been, the, 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 they've been planting these seeds for a while. We said leading into uh, WrestleMania that it should be Rock Cody. We're going to get it at SummerSlam. You're the boss, right? You're, my, you're not just the final boss, you're on the board with TKO, you're actually my literal boss. Sylvia says, Rock, Cody, I wouldn't mind seeing. I think it will be epic. Rock going away to make a movie, yes. I am the champion, I am their champion. Getting closer and closer to the rock. That means I'm your champion. Getting in the grill of the rock, looking the rock face to face. Which is technically is true. He is his champion. Cody, Cody, Cody. So good. You are my champion.
Cody Rhodes is one last thing before the final boss rides off into the distance he's got something to give him no fireworks he's reaching into his pocket he's going to flip in the bird he's going to stick one up at him <laughs> what's that what is giving him he's put it in his hand What is he giving him? You don't have to hope in your hand to know what this is. Don't ever break my heart again, he says. Can you smell what the final boss is cooking? So he's put something in his hand. Don't ever break my heart again. So something personal uh, has been placed into Cody Rhodes' hand. Hall of Fame ring? Don't ever break my heart again. A ring of some sort, I don't know. Uh, something what is literally got uh, under the skin of Cody anyway. Don't know what the hell that was. Almost a pleasure to see you guys even even when I start my shenanigans. <laughs> wow, shots have been yeah, shots have been fired. Michael Cole has said it. We have had <sighs> 45 minutes of absolute pleasure. Cody Rock coming soon. <coughs> Unbelievable. But what did he hand Cody? Well, it's uh, incense, Cody. Here is uh, Judgment Day with the gold. The championship way. Rock is not the final boss. I am. <laughs> Triple H long term booking. We ain't finding out what that is for a while. Yep. Uh, we've got the tag team champs. Uh, awesome truth. And then we've got Sammy, new intercontinental champion. With his wife and his little one. Oh, that little one's ace. His kid's the star. We, we're finally here. We're finally getting introduced to Michael Cole and Pat McAvey. Mac 40, 46 minutes in, we might get a wrestling match. 15 minutes before we get an actual hard break as well. Oh, we've got the Spanish announced desk. They're here again. Well, we're getting used to these Spanish guys, aren't we? <laughs> Will they be at SmackDown? <laughs> what the hell just happened? That took 45 minutes. What happened was pure TV gold. That's what's just happened. Great, oh, oh man, and we got Nakamura, and it all started with Triple H. Man, Khalid, shout out to you, Dave. I expect a surprise tonight, Bo Dallas Vignette. I think we get in quite a few surprises tonight, dude. Maybe this is the start of it. Who knows? We got Nakamura in uh, on his way down to the ring. Two of his new elite figures were announced uh, at. Uh, WWE world they looked awesome who is he up against is the question so we got Nakamura on his way 45 minutes in and no wrestling can I hear Jim Cornette shouting at his TV from the UK <laughs> Shinsuke search some insanity look at this guy he's fucking awesome man should have had a title reign for sure. Was he the first ever Royal Rumble winner? What never never got won the title? Or was that Edge? Who is it? We're not being announced. Who's this? It's dragging off. Yeah, it is only your NXT champion, Lilia Dragonoff. Hello. Talk about a match. This is going to be Russian Strong Style versus Jap uh, Japanese Strong Style. Naka oh man. Just like, look at this. Oh, um, gee. 
a match I didn't think I wanted, but we're getting. Oh my god. I'm going pretty good. Khalid, always good to see you, my friend. Uh, Cody Rhodes looks awesome with the belt. Acknowledge Cody Rhodes. He is my new tribal chief. <laughs> uh, Ever, you are right, but I think he'll prove approve the main event last night. Did you see Cross in the little trunks yesterday, Ever? <laughs> oh, God, girls. Girls in the chat. Oh, my God, girls. Uh, be right back, says Cynthia. Uh, he would be glad that Cody won. That's it. Let's see if you're always great to see you. Uh, Lee and Jagunov, I know, man. Jagunov, who had, uh, was the uh, main event, well, he had a big match against Tony D at Stand and Deliver. This is arguably bigger. Main roster. Holy shit, Lilia. I know, man. Nakamura, Lilia. <laughs> Best Raw ever. I'm Jim. I'm a Jim Cornette guy. I love Jim Cornette. He's ace. Yeah, Jim Cornette is one of the best. Says it as it is. People don't like how straightforward he is, but I do. I like people what take take no prisoner. Uh, it's strong style is definitely on the table here. Jagunov, not someone what messes around. Pure hard hitting. Nakamura down, Jagunov going up. Oh, nice into the midsection of Nakamura. Oh, Jagunov's going to win this. I know that's going to upset a lot of people, but he is out question. Uh, but when Roman Reigns returns, he returns as a face. That's yeah, I think that might happen actually. Now, oh, nice German by a Russian. Uh, have you? Uh, all seen AJ Styles Nakamura from Rest, uh, Wrestle Kingdom. People don't like the truth. Jim tells the truth. Facts. Oh, nice. Nice clothesline taking down Nakamura. Jackanoff, not a stranger to the main roster, though. He has been here before. He fought uh, Gunther at, uh, I think it was the. A Survivor Series, or what's that, Pete Dunn? I'm sure, these two fought on the main roster before. Uh, main pay per view. Dragging off up, goes down. Nobody there. <laughs> Nakamura is a jobber. People, uh, it's Dave C and Punk Drew definitely having a match at SummerSlam. If Punk can, if he can, if he's fit enough, yes, I'd agree. Nakamura's taking the advantage. Going up. He's on middle rope. Bret Hart's middle rope. Takes down uh, Dragunov. Goes for the pin. Dragunov kicks out. He's your NXT champion. They were saying that he wasn't going to go to the main roster. He's not technically. Oh. Oh. Taking his teeth. Oops. Has Nakamura gone a little bit too uh, heavy? Nakamura not a stranger to strong style. German but gets a knee to the back of the head Nakamura has been badly booked in WWE watch his New Japan stuff yeah, NXT stuff if you if you don't want to go further back than that watch NXT his match against Sami Zayn in NXT brilliant <coughs> it's when he went to the main roster that he got badly booked it's because Vince McMahon doesn't like Japanese people. Or foreigners. Oh, nice slap. Lilia Dragunov's best matches were with Walter. Before Walter changed his name to Gunter. Big knee to uh, Lillian Dragunov. Dave, I want to see Liv Morgan tonight. She should be there, man. She's got to be, right? If Rhea's there, the revenge tour's got to start tonight. Or oh, well, there's no point in doing it. Uh, hope Damien Priest keeps the belt for a while. Sammy and Nakamura in NXT was ace, to be fair. Yeah, it's fucking a right match. A right match. What a rivalry they had. So that was good storytelling. Torpedo takes down Nakamura. One, two, three. Dragunov is your winner. 
NXT male champion Nulia Dragunov picks up a victory on Monday Night Raw. This guy is impressive. People will know who he is. He's been around the block, certainly. NXT UK, NXT. Really impressive. Certainly would look good on the main roster. Well, the crowd know Lily at least. <laughs> Most of these went to stand and deliver, I'm sure. There's that Wrestling Days face in the crowd, so... Uh, wrestler we Andy is in attendance tonight, so Daze's face in the in in front full view. So Daze getting uh, excellent praise tonight, right in the camera. Just spotted him. That's Wrestle with Andy, which is uh, a Scottish YouTuber. Does a lot of the uh, like uh, history videos. He gets an American guy to do the voiceover there. He's from Scotland. It is uh, WrestleWay Andy. <coughs> Khalid Priest will keep the belt till June. Drop it to Drew McIntyre in Scotland at Clash at the Castle. Yeah, yeah, I can imagine that. They'll, they'll give they'll give it back to Drew at some point. For CM Punk then to take it off him at SummerSlam. <laughs> yeah, you know it's going to make sense. We're seeing it now, Drew McIntyre. There is CM Punk grabbing his legs. Breaking news, draft will be the 26th of April 29th. WE confirmed on X. Imagine LA Knight getting drafted to Raw. Could be big things. Obviously Cody will probably get drafted to SmackDown with the absence of Roman. Uh, of Damien Priest stays on Raw. Uh, Drew, better win at Castle or I will riot. <laughs> and I'm not even Scottish. It's good, man. So look at this first hour, man. We've done an hour. Drew McIntyre is here. I said he was going to leave if he didn't win the belt. He won the belt, so. Get him looking down the barrel of the camera. He does not look impressed. There's Damien Priest. There is Judgment Day. Are they on their way to the ring? Judgment Day are up next. It was perfectly put. Cash in, to be honest. I've been caught. I called it in the predictions video. I said Damien. I was... If Damien didn't cash in before uh, WrestleMania, there was only one place that you could cash in. You wouldn't cash in anywhere else. What's the point? You've got WrestleMania. If you don't cash in at WrestleMania, what is the point in being a wrestler? He's waited all year. Failed cash-ins. And the story made sense because Drew was the one that was stopping the cash-ins. He stopped it on numerous occasions, so it made sense for it to be cashed in on Drew. Drew had his moment for about six minutes, <laughs> only for CM Punk to take it away. Drew pretty much better kill Priest tonight, also that. <laughs> Same for you, Miss Nakamura getting jobbed out by Dragunov. Nakamura, yeah, I feel that Nakamura's bless him is is kind of getting the afterthought use, pretty much like Shayna Baszler, which is it's not fair. I I feel like Shayna Baszler's got at least one title run left in her, but they get jobbed out now. I mean, Shayna's main priority priority is to look after Zoe Stark and get her ready. I don't know who he is. But uh, thank you, Cole. <laughs> she doesn't know who Dragunov is. Uh, she doesn't watch NXT. Shaquem says, AJ Lee, come on. <laughs> I don't know if we see AJ Lee, but it would be fun. He's the NXT champion, says Cole. He is too right. That Cynthia doesn't watch NXT, so she doesn't know. It, it is... Trying to explain who Dragonoff is. Dragonoff basically blonde hair, little beard, 
you know, goatee uh, comes out to like classical Russian classical music I would say he, he just wears a robe nothing sensational about his entrances or anything like that but he's just a hard hitting Russian wrestler wrestler uh, basically has beaten Gunther in the past <laughs> let's put it that way he's beaten Gunther uh, I am good rebel how are you Dave knows me so well uh, Carl I am doing great cool what a great first hour though what a flipping hour honestly you sat there just watching going what's he going to do what's he going to say <sighs> What has he put in Cody's hand? What is it? What what is it? And um, what is the past between the Rock and uh, or uh, Rocky Johnson and Dusty Rhodes? What is that? What is that about? Don't ever break my heart again. What the what? Don't break my heart again. What does that actually literally mean? Oh, somebody go into the history books and find out if there was any beef between Rocky Johnson and Dusty. <laughs> Even knows my bra size. <laughs> Triple D. Triple D. She's got huge puppies. <laughs> Don't know how I know that, but flipping heck, wang. When we were together last, she was running and she nearly gave herself black eyes. past weekend which was only yesterday honestly look at this ah. why does night one seem like a month ago that it happened we sat here we're watching raw and we've just done wrestlemania it's like what don't even realize we've just done wrestlemania weekend what what is going off you have to forgive me out irish i am so touched Cynthia, I was uh, fixing my something to eat. Fixing my something to eat. What, what, what kind of English language is that? I am fixing my something to eat. You're making your tea, basically. He's making his tea. Just having a look. <laughs> socials very cool <coughs> actually I've done uh, done eating there are the judgment day we've got JD McDonough we've got Finn Balor Dominic boo Mysterio obviously they're going to announce their champions WWE draft returning April 26 Smackdown and t April 29th Raw very good, very good. Cannot wait. Usually good. Usually some big things happen. Get a bit of a refresh on each show, which is always good. Imagine Karrion Cross on Monday Night Raw. <coughs> <coughs> Probably having Dave in real life figure too. What? <coughs> <coughs> Jesus, Cynthia, there might be children present. Yeah. It's a surprise. A su it, it, it's a surprise to come. Oh, there's surprises. There's loads of surprises. Here comes Mammy. Still your world champion. If anyone should be world champion, it should have been Finn. Is that Rhea or the lead singer of uh, that band? What did her entrance? He might have traded her. Mammy on the way down to a ring. Ripley is an absolute star. She is. She's into her own groove, man. <coughs> 
No more talking segments tonight, please, Trips. I can see why they're doing this one. It's the title changes in it. We'll do it again with Sammy later, though. But that might kick off the final hour. This kind of makes sense, though. And the final boss boss. Uh, he and Shinsuke got jobbed out to Seth. What a waste. There is Mammy. Motionless in white and my favourite band. That's the band. The lead singer looks looked like Rhea Ripley from a couple of years ago. Unbelievable. Here we go, we're waiting for Damien Priest. Mommy, mommy. Rhea was perfect. She was uh, those stupid extensions. She looks like all the other women. Uh, CM Punk has a segment tonight, but he's got a produce. It's got a producer, which generally means it could get physical. Drew Punk face off. Interesting. Mammy's always on top. This is a new era for the Judgment Day, of course, Damien Priest. Well, good, but I'd rather have Samantha Irving do it. <laughs> Here comes Damien, the archer of the group. Got his own little solo uh, apocalypse member. Here he comes, Damien Priest. He was out partying. We've seen with a big bottle of, uh, I don't know what bottle it was, a tequila maybe. Uncle Howdy teased before Raw, similar to White Rabbit. Was there? Was there? Oh, we'd not see that. Okay, okay, I bet that's doing the rounds then. It's interesting. See if it's up on the X already. Let's have a look at that then. That'll be on X right now, won't it? We're going to start doing the QR codes again. Are we going to be on uh, that watch? Pretty cool if we are. Uh, Damien has a new solo theme, WWE 2K24, outdated a month after release. <laughs> NXT champion. Is there anything on here? Just the old rock Cody stuff. Was before Raw started, was before. We didn't get to see it then here in the UK. I'm just trying to look now if it's on WWE, if they've put anything out. Yeah, I'm not seeing anything so far on social. Okay, so we might not get to see that then. So it's a bit shit. I wonder if people in America have seen it. Uh, was uh, one match so far? There is being one match, yes. Only one match so far. We actually, there is a video on WWE of the uh, side plates. Uh, World Heavyweight Championship for uh, for Damian Priest. His side plates are now in. There is a video. There you go. There is Damien Priest side plates being put in. So there you go, you can see how they do it. It'll come out in the wash. We will see the fallout of that. Uh, you deserve it, chance for Damien. Not sure 100% agree with that. 
he had to cash in at some point how long he has the belt is uh, another question but he is for now our <laughs> truth comes in with his championship our truth what lols he still thinks he's part of judgment day Our truth has brought the tag titles back to the judgment day Here comes uh, Miz. Ah, Chief, this makes me laugh, man. Here comes Miz. Sure, Miz does not want to be a part of Judgment Day. Do we get a tag match? JD McDonough, Dominic Mysterio up against the uh, Awesome Truth. What do you think? I think we might be going down that road. So if you're not a part of Judgment Day. So if you don't actually want to be in Judgment Day. I saw, I just saw Wrestling Days' head in the crowd, I know. This has got a massive head. It is actually Wrestling Days. We are massive head. Too much talk, he said, but tonight, yeah. Breaking news, Dragunov has declared himself in the draft. Yep, loving it. Stick up the titles. You think you're so funny, don't you, Vin Mint? Yeah, here we go. The challenge is going to be made. Taxi titles on the line right here, right now. Tech match. Hey. Three of us. Oh my god, have we got little Jimmy returning? Uh, Mrs. Green, you are talking about a real person and not little Jimmy. Oh, we're getting a call up. Six man. Six man. Is this trick? Is this trick Williams? Are we whooping that trick? Are we going to whoop? Are we whooping the trick? Is this where he comes? Three on three. JD McDonough, Finn Balor, Dominic Mysterio against Miz. It's a false. False. Surprise! Okay. Once I've got to disagree with Finn. <laughs> Here we go. Our truth is going to. Oh, they're beating him up with... Oh, come on. Who's coming out? Kelly says, whoop that trick. I don't know if it is, but I feel like this could be. They're beating up Miz and Nartru for the minute. Whoever it is, is coming to save. Finn, Dominic, JD McDonough, up against Awesome Truth and Mystery Guest. After the break, We've got Becky doing some running, and we've moved away from that, so we don't get to see what that is about. I'm going to quickly nip for a pee while we're at an ad break. Another pee, I know. Jesus. Right, I'll be back in two minutes.
welcome back, welcome back. Jimmy was here. Yes, he was. Uh, it's John Cena. You can't see him. Yeah, it could be John Cena, though, couldn't it? Because, uh, obviously, Archive does a lot of uh, tributes to Cena. But, uh, it's John Cena, says Jesse. It'll be Cena, Chief said. The guy you can't see. Yeah, John said, boop, boop, boop. There better be a surprise or a debut tonight because it's getting tired. I'm, I'm getting tired. I've got to be up in five hours. And we've had one surprise at the Lillian Dragonoff. And we kind of wasn't really expecting The Rock, to be fair. Even though, obviously, he's still there. So we should have expected it, really. <sighs> But we're back nearly from the commercial break. We have got uh, Formula One, I think, or some kind of motor racing. Oh, it's the uh, Formula E, whatever that is. It's Dave, that awesome truth partner. It's me. That's where I just went. I've just uh, got changed. <laughs> So apparently there was a tease for Uncle Howdy before Raw started tonight. Interesting. So our American audience uh, have had the tease. We didn't get that here in the UK. Boo. <laughs> Not fair. So we've got a two on three handicap. So, uh, <laughs> oh, thank you. Thank you guys. I only nipped away for a couple of minutes while we were at an ad break. I feel like we've got we've uh, we've calmed down a little bit from all the excitement. Now we're uh, getting some wrestling. Interesting. There's a woman in the crowd with green hair just yawning her head off. I mean, she's been at every single event. I think she was even at Stand and Deliver crowd started to clap you think that that crowd has literally been there all weekend as well I mean they're probably enjoying the fact that they're actually inside now there is somebody in the crowd what has a striking resemblance to Bray Wyatt it's next to a guy in white don't know if you can quite see him but it's a guy it's just sat there I'm sure it's Bray Wyatt inspired it's like a wine shirt on with a, a straw hat. Very much like Bray Wyatt. I just thought I'd point that out to you. Let me know if you can see him. So, uh, McDonough has... Uh, in fact, we'll change this round. Because uh, we've actually got a match. I have to do some work. <laughs> So I achieved down. So there we go, we've got Judgment Day versus Awesome Truth. We'll just put Awesome Truth. Or I used to call them Amazing Truth because I forgot that it was awesome. <laughs> it's just a video that I did and I forgot that Awesome Truth existed and I thought they were called Amazing Truth. For some strange reason. There we go, wait, that'll do it. So there we go, Judgment Day versus Awesome Truth. Could have just put six man tag, but it's not really a six man tag, is it? Uh Dave Drew, Damien Priest in Scotland where Drew takes back the title. Yep, I, I kind of agree with that. Dave I would like to see Uncle Howdy back. I think he will. I think he comes back. I think you will expect something like that. Follow the buzzards, run, RIP Bray. They probably will show that segment in this show. I'm sure we'll get all treated to it. I don't think it'll be just for the American audience. I have to wait and see, eh? Miz, getting cocky, is taking out the two members of Judgment Day.
setting got Dominic gonna set him up for a famous elbow though Drew uh, Finn takes out Miz Dominic distracting the referee as uh, Finn has got uh, Miz they're beating him up outside will the mystery a partner make themselves known boo boo boo, boo. Miz is down beaten as we go to yeah, we go into another ad break fucking hell mate I'm off for another pee <laughs> I think the true holy fuck moment tonight will happen when you think the show has finished yeah they'll put the they'll fake us out won't they they'll put the fake little logo up in the corner and then it'll be like boom they, they love doing that don't they the bastards <laughs> Sorry, I keep up disappearing everywhere. Anything is okay. Just uh, winding down before bed. You're winding down before bed. What are you doing? Going for a marathon? Do you go for a run around the yard or something? Around the local block? Jesus Christ, Cynthia, just calm down. <sighs> Us guys in here in the UK for what's bedtime? <laughs> We forget how late it is here in the UK. It's it's madness. You're like eleven o'clock. Is a, a good time for you to go to bed. We're like, yeah, it's like gonna be four o'clock for us. <coughs> I feel like this. It's it's always the second hour. It's always the second hour. What always seems to drag, uh, on rots. Don't you think? It's always that second hour. It's like we we get the good stuff at the beginning, like we've add tonight it can it's just get it slows right down the middle of the show it slows right down and then we start pushing back up again for the last hour now we're in the slow part part of it now Cody is outnumbered once again gets saved by MJF that tonight is Cody in action tonight what match is he in have they announced a match for Cody tonight I didn't think he was in action. I thought that's we was done with Cody tonight. But <laughs> oh, you found this in booking again there, uh, Mister James Chadwick. Cynthia, what are you and James cooking up? Even uh, up, don't even what? Uh, right now it's nine twenty-two. Yeah, you lucky shit. That was hours ago here in the UK. Irish Rebel, I haven't even started anything yet. I'm innocent in this. <coughs> Cynthia Innocent. Cynthia Innocent. Ha! Ha! He ain't, but uh, doesn't mean a beat down can't happen. Uh, I know what you're saying. Oh, it, it was Instagram. <laughs> Lady Ray UK added a photograph. Let's have a look. <laughs> this is me just being a pervert now. David Real Life is live. I've got a new subscriber, Col. Hello, Col. Shout out to you, Col. We know that you've subscribed anyway. You're awesome, dude. Thank you for the subscription anyway. I just check my phone and I've got we've got a new subscriber. Uh Plus, I'm just having a fun prediction. It's like fine, we can blast away. This is uh, what I was talking about. I just got that post. It, yeah, it's pervert hour in it. And there, I don't know if I can show this. I mean, it is PG, but there's a woman in a shower. It's definitely a woman. Irish Rebel, yeah, that's for you. <laughs> the thing is this woman right on Instagram I don't know her her face always looks like she's shocked <laughs> anyway I thought I'd share that with you that's the notification what you just heard when her phone just went rawr, rawr. <laughs> Dave shoosh <coughs> Cynthia shoosh it would be worth being uh, tired tomorrow if MJF shows up, but I can't see it. Be besides, 
who does he go for? Cody's already been on TV. Punk. There's no one I can see him uh, debuting against. It's Trick Williams. It's Trick Williams. Well, we're expecting Cena. We're back to the action. McDonough is flexing. I don't know what he's flexing because there's nothing there. Here we go, it is. John Cena. Boo, boo, doo, boo. <laughs> Never good pub. It is John Cena, of course, he's here. Hello. We want surprises. Yeah, I, I, I did say before we started that John Cena would show up. He's here. Boo, boo, in his bald patch. And he's here. And he wants to tag in. Here you go. Miz tags to Cena. Boo, boo, doo, boo. <laughs> Do I think Cynthia is incorrect? Lol, 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 lol. Here he comes. John Cena back on Monday Night Raw. There we go. Surprise. Oh, surprise. Ba, ba, da, ba. <laughs> I'm sorry, Cynthia. Cena's here. Look at our truth. Hey. They're all going to do the five knuckle shuffle. You can't see me. Boom. They're all wanking, basically. <laughs> STF. Off we go, boom, all three members of Judgment Day now. Uh, and this is their error. Didn't go too well, did it? John Cena, Miz, Embrace, Our truth has found his friend. Unbelievable. That is Raw After Mania. That is what you get. Boo, 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 boo. I choose childhood hero despite being old. <laughs> I know. It's class, isn't it? Uh, just, just seeing Cena and the match already over, over for me. <laughs> the match is already over for me. Yeah, just seeing him run out and it's like ah, we're done. <laughs> Cena being back is always good. Come on, just nostalgia now. Do, 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 do. Crowd love it. Oh god! Oh, I thought her top was literally gonna come down. Then she was proper too excited. She's like she's like holding the top. Imagine if she'd have uh, dropped them out then. I've seen enough male boobies. We need a bit of. There's Bray just clapping in the background. Oh my god, that dad just nearly threw that kid in. He wasn't happy. The kid was like, Dad? Nearly threw him? Be on TV! Uh, you don't... Uh, you ain't done it wrong. Oh, uh, we got uh, Smackdown. We saw Bronson and I... Are we getting Bronson and Ivar? Uh, you ain't done no wrong. James, to be honest, I am innocent. What are you guys on about? What the drift? Seems to be a what have you done, mate? What the what what's going off in the chat? What is going off in the chat? Bronson is has he managed to carry the trophy? Promo time backstage. It's Bronson. means absolute jack shit ooh there was a flicker on the screen then did you see it what was that was that a brave that was that a it's quite misty backstage Uncle Howdy what's with the mist there's a, a, a fatal four way match thing ricochet Bronson Reed J main event Uso Drew McIntyre I think Smackdown Cody on Smackdown 
to Smackdown Cody and Bailey. We are live. Oh, definitely be live for Bailey celebration. Oh, I think I can't behave. I am, in fact, behaving. The absolute shame, I know. What, 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 you are actually being innocent. What the chuff? See, Dave and Irish, I told you I can be innocent. Sorry, but this trophy means nothing. No, it, yeah, it does. I, I totally agree. It's like stood there. It's never been provident. It's never meant anything. It's not like you cash it in and you get a title shot. It means fuck all. Uh, you you won a pre-show battle royal. Well done. <laughs> it's not elevated like the big show or Braun Strowman or any other person what's won it. They've not done anything. Remember when Baron Corbin won it? <laughs> you know what I mean? Man, I think didn't even Jojo Riley win it. It's like, fuck all. It means nothing. When a jobber like Jojo Riley wins it, it's like... Oh, and then we had uh, Bray and uh, Matt Hardy. Remember when, I think it was Matt Hardy what won it, and then Bray came out. Uh, don't think that trophy ever meant anything. Trophies belong, it don't belong in wrestling. Yeah, I remember Bret Hart breaking the trophy after losing. Did you get a glitch, Dave? Yeah, there was a glitch during the Bronson uh, Creed uh, promo. It glitched. Don't know what that was. I don't know if that's anything to uh, talk about, but there was a glitch. It glitched. For, only for about a split second, but you know what? You've got to take these things into account when Bo Dallas fiend Uncle Audi. Congratulations, Dave. You have 551 subs now. Cool. I know. I did check. It's awesome. I need to push. We're pushing on to 600 nicely. We're halfway to 600. Love it. Keep on pushing. Keep on pushing. That is the aim now to just keep on going. It's been awesome. We've last couple of months have been mega for this channel, honestly. Can't thank everybody enough. We are really pushing the envelope with this channel now. It's really uh, picking up the pace. Uh, I like it. I like it a lot. Kathy Kelly is hot, says Shaquem. Dave has been. Dave has been in the Matrix late. <laughs> I am in the Matrix. I took the other pill. <laughs> I don't know uh, how Americans put up with uh, many commercials. It breaks my brain, I know. Congratulations on 551 subs, Dave. Thank you. Thank you, Leeds. Uh, everyone just predicted that The Rock handed Cody's matches. He said, intensify if you smell what the final boss is cook. What if he set Cody's bus on fire? <sighs> That's interesting. That is interesting. But then said, why break my heart? You broke my heart. Don't ever break my heart again is what he said to Cody as he left the ring. Don't break my heart again. What did that mean? But that's interesting. It's a good theory. I like it. <laughs> Working. Hmm. I kind of like that. Okay. Okay. We could. That could work. Uh, I'm pushing 40 subs. Yes, you are. Jesse, Jack, and my shout out to you. Keep pushing, my friend. Keep that content going. Dave, I will. Uh, uh, Pete and so, cut all right, wrestle top before you know it. Uh, I will never get as big as them. They are above me, me, my friend. I'll not get as far as them. But pushing, we'll just, just get in. Proper monetized is where what I want to do. Getting to a thousand subs would be that. That's the game. That's the aim. We'll get to that, and then sky's the limit. Uh, maybe Uncle Howdy glitched Dave, it could be, I don't know, I don't know if everybody else saw that glitch. I was hoping to catch my uh, friend Cody's reaction but to Cody winning last night, but he never did his stream. Oh, Liv Morgan finally, revenge tour. Oh, she's finally done it, oh my god. Liv Morgan attacks Rhea Ripley backstage. About fucking time. And then uh, gets stopped by uh, 
referees and stuff. But Rhea Ripley attacked by Rhea, uh, by Liv Morgan backstage. Revenge tour has started. And Dominic pushes the cameraman away. And the cameraman decides just to leave anyway and go out into the crowd. There you go. <laughs> Uh, broke his heart because he took his mum uh, main event. Main event. All right. Okay. Okay. Don't break my heart again. Okay. That's uh, interesting. Have we come out strange way? But we've got Candice LeRae and Indy Artwell. Here is Roxanne Perez. Then Indy Artwell in the ring. We're getting Roxanne Perez. Apparently, that was uh, broken to us earlier on. Jesse, get the tissues. My queen, 100% James. Very good. It is the prodigy, the NXT female champion, Perez, is here. Perez, we heart well. She just won that championship. At stand and deliver. We did the watch along for it. So Perez versus Hartwell. Boom is what we're getting. Here it is. There is the OMFG. The, the camera did there where they pushed it. And we went into the crowd. That was quite cool. Bit weird that Dominic made that happen. <laughs> what a push by Dominic. Got flipping strength on that kid. I don't think a lot of my comments are coming through I'm not uh, saying anything bad or swearing. I just noticed that. Ah, I don't know. I don't know why your comments are not coming through. I put a block on you. That's a very good thing, Col. I like that. Can you smell what the Irish Foz is cooking? <coughs> so there's Indy Artwell versus Roxanne Perez. Welcome to Monday Night Raw. She slaps uh, Hartwell. I'm sure these two have had fights before in NXT. Perez still wearing Philly colours. Indy Hartwell. She's got a, a chokehold on Indy Hartwell at the minute. Candice LeRae is in the corner of Hartwell. Uh, Dave, what are you doing to my comments? I'm blocking you. Uh, you were talking about sex toys, so it's just like no, block. <laughs> I'm uh, censoring you, Cynthia. I'm censoring you, Roxanne. Love this heel, Roxanne. In fact, real Roxanne, Roxanne should be right down Candice Lorraine's having you. Candice, being a bit of a heel herself, should be loving this kind of would feel odd if Candice actually goes against Perez <laughs> both heels Perez uh, pushes down Hartwell Stats working on the leg Stats kicking away this is good man, could be weird about censoring even if it is but YouTube can be weird about censoring, yeah YouTube's weird, there's no censoring on my phone, it's all YouTube anything what they think is racist sexist they usually put a block on it it's uh, actually what if Cody stole Rock's main event and Rocky put his bus on fire handed in the matches or a lighter that has to be it yeah th yeah, th it was mentioned by James it's great it's great how they've worked that into a story into a lure I love it it's quite cool it could, yeah, it could be matches Oh, no, no doubt about it. It's, it was small enough to be in a pocket. So, yeah. Interesting. I like it. Good, good. Good stuff. Video time. <laughs> I don't know. Could do a video on that, couldn't I? Oh, so much good stuff. So much content could be created. There is uh, Candice getting in the face of Indy. But Rox and rakes the eyes. Kick to the midsection. Pop rock coming. Pop rock is coming. Pop rock. Boom. One, two, three. Easy peasy. Distraction by Candice LeRae. Unintentional, but it it happened, uh, and it cost uh, Indy. Rock. 
Roxanne Perez, NXT female champion. Pop rocks. Loving the new gimmick. Uh, like last night, going uh, into Raw, the, the, the word racist was censored, even though it wasn't a comment about racism. Uh, fun fact, Indy took the title from Roxanne Perez last year at Stand and Deliver Dave. She didn't take it. She didn't. Uh, Roxanne Perez have to hand it to her. She won it, didn't she? Uh, uh, like uh, a ladder match or something, daft. Something like that. Roxanne didn't actually get pinned for the title, did she? That's what I'm trying to say. Highlights from Mania. Logan Paul arrives at WrestleMania on a prime frame truck. And then he has a prick of a friend join him. Who gets destroyed by Randy Orton. Lols. Fun fact, they took the time. Oh, um, but you uh, can curse and stuff and perv on women and stuff. Doesn't make sense. Said Cynthia, Cynthia, you perv on men, shut up. Your comments get through. There's nobody more pervy on men than you, Cynthia Martin. Don't even dare. Don't even dare. NXT getting over big time tonight. Colt, you are correct. Good, it's good. People should know how good NXT is, because that show is fire. And if I feel well enough, we will do the watch along to that tomorrow. It's set up. Whether I'm set up for it is another question. It's all. <coughs> it's all your fault, Dave. I'm going to go cry in the corner now. Don't put baby in the corner. There is uh, Jay Main Event Uso with Sami Zayn. Proud of you, man. So proud. Some pride moments here. Stephen, no one asked. No one cared. It's hilarious that AEW are going to show the CCTV footage of Punk, Jungle Boy, Dynamite. Punk's in WWE, AEW still using him to try and get ratings bump. Yep. It's because they've got nothing else. Got nothing else. Why put a like? I like watching porn. Seriously, don't care. Is that what he's put? Where's that comment? I didn't even see that comment. Let's have a look. So, uh, where are we looking? Has it been... Uh, I am doing USA 30 on Saturday. That was the last one I saw. Has it even come through? Steven, 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 Steven. It's not even come through. It's the YouTube didn't like it. I don't see it. Did you block it? Did you block that comment, James? <laughs> because I don't see that comment. Which is not a bad thing. I think I've just stopped my chat. Oh, it's done that chat thing again. Oh, there we go. We're alive again. Boom. Uh. Why put what? Uh, since if that comment didn't even exist, I don't know. That didn't come up on my uh, chat. Uh, James, I do what I can. I like watching porn. So when did he put that in? No, YouTube did. Yeah, I think. Yeah, YouTube banned it. <laughs> I'm gonna say I didn't see it. Can't do that. Right? You can't just say you like watching porn. I can. You can't, you can't get rid of me. YouTube. I like watching porn. Ha. But I won't put it into the chat. That's just wrong. <laughs> we're at an ad break. Anyway, uh, Perez Artwell. I don't know what we're getting next, but... Been good, man. An hour and 15 minutes left to go. the storage relax on iPhone 15 
I've got to admit the bus theory with the matches that's great I love that that that's awesome that is good thinking uh, I'm sure we all do but we don't need to broadcast it to everyone no anybody who doesn't watch porn you're just lying you are lying somebody's watched porn at least once in their lifetime I don't give a fuck who you are I'm sure my gran even watched porn once right it's going going faster I don't think it is <laughs> I don't feel like it is but I have been streaming for two hours 43 minutes already so that's probably the reason why I don't think it has <sighs> Ra hasn't really set up any feud so far no it's a bit of long term storytelling with uh, Cody and Rock uh, so fair play to that but no we've not really fast forward anything yet but we're building uh, Liv Morgan, Rhea Ripley, that's a feud, what's coming. So there's that, we saw that just happen. So that's good. And I think there's time for CM Punk, there's time for Drew. Yeah, I feel that they're coming. We're just seeing that stand and deliver, we've got tomorrow night, we'll see some matches announced for tomorrow. And we're just showing you highlights from uh, stand and deliver. And it's just saying live. Say so it's from USA, but it's not. It's on the network here in the UK. There is uh, Roxanne Perez backstage. Oh, looking right evil down the camera. Oh, hello, Natalia. It's hard to not look at her puppies, right? <laughs> Got to be somewhat careful with kids watching and whatnot. Why you think everyone's gone? Never gone full on me. I ah, know you know that, mate. Sami Zayn is on his way. I am single. I refuse to keep. Uh, I just sleep with anyone. I have more respect for myself. We're not fucking every guy that comes along. Well done, Cynthia. Keep that ethics. <laughs> uh, Rick Hunter says, uh, YouTube, quit. Pick Cynthia, please. <laughs> Pick on Cynthia, please. Ah. Sami Zayn, your new IC champion. Didn't see that coming at all. Great. He finally defeated what seemed to be an absolutely unbeatable gunfer. Sami Zayn, take a bow. A lot of people wanted him to be world champion. But come on. Save that for private DMs with Dave. <laughs> you do. Oh, if, if only people knew. James, we would be cancelled. We would be cancelled. Oh, don't worry, anybody in the chat, don't worry. It's not about you guys. <laughs> oh, could it be? <laughs> Revelations. My head says Sammy was a good call to beat Gunther, but my heart says Chad G yeah, Chad Gable should come out and challenge Sammy. That could be interesting. It's Dave behind the scenes blocking me, Rick. It can't it won't be the first time he's done it. I'm always blocking you behind the scenes. God, that sounds so bad. <laughs> You're blocked. I could see Chad actually say coming out in this segment to be quite honest with you the fans are just proper whoa loving this and so he should he deserves it uh, watch for so far Sammy 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 it's going to take us into the final hour That's uh, that's for sure Looks a bit battered, doesn't he? Got some red marks on that face of his. You deserve it. Cock blocked. <laughs> I don't know what you mean. Cynthia, I don't know what you mean. Uh, let's see if it goes through. Uh, cancel arrows. Cancel arrows. <laughs> Got to go there. All right, Schleed, shout out to you, mate. Thank you for stopping by, my friend. Hopefully you've enjoyed this uh, first two hours of raw been blast mate thank you for stopping by 
have a great rest of your night bud uh, well 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 it's actually went through I guess I think they're talking about a, a chicken or cock I think that I did at least Jimmy didn't cock block me alright you can write cock block doesn't mean you have to write it 10,000 times <coughs> You can boo. Oh, have a good night, Leeds. Owls in fear. 66 days. The devil. 666 days. 666 is fucking Satan. Sami Zayn defeated Satan. To become your IC champion. Facts. Going for this title reign with 666. Eventually it'll get through. Cody putting over Roman. Sammy putting over Gunther. The new era should be called the Respectful Era. Welcome to Ring of Honor. <laughs> They'll be shaking hands next. 69 me. Oh, oh my god. Wine me, dine me, 69 me. Cynthia's new song. Raw has been good tonight. It's been it's been alright, yeah, it's been cool. 666, the devil's number. I would not want that number. Gumpher's got it. 666 rain. Damn it. Lots of call outs here. Exactly like it's exactly like Ring of Honor. <laughs> Welcome to the respect era. Hustle, loyalty, and respect. Just waiting for the confetti. Here we go. It's it's not Gunther, it's the Stooges. Ludwig Vorga and uh, Ludwig the Kaiser, sorry. Ludwig Barger, Barger, he's coming out of retirement or death, whichever it is. <laughs> Sammy saved us from Satan Gunther. So we've got Kaiser and uh, Finchy. The most prestigious. Have a song that is dirty, but I know I, I love it so much. But I can't listen to it a lot. You know a song that is dirty. Somebody like you. John Cena getting old. Yes he is. Irish Rebel knows that song. I sent it to him. Don't stop moving baby all night long. I drive you crazy. Oh wiggle wiggle. <laughs> Is that the song? I love the way your pussy tastes. <laughs> it's a very sexy song. Sammy. These are not getting a good reception from this crowd. The guy who was wearing the suit is now wearing a big orange t-shirt. They are here to make it right. So Vinci and Kaiser are coming down to Sammy. Oh, come on, KO. Kevin Owens coming. Or have we got Yeet? Kevin Owens, I reckon. Kevin Owens comes. Well, his best mates and he's there. We know he's there. Oh no, Chad Gable. Shoosh! Here comes Chad. Tag team. Imperium. Chad and uh, Sammy coming up. Shoosh! Thank you! Thank you! Um, 
Gable. Zane. V. M. Perry. Um. Do 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 do. Probably spelling Perry and wrong. I don't care. Boom. There we go. Chad. Too much talking tonight. So not. To, how many matches have we had? We've had about what three matches, four matches maybe. Thinking about four, I think. Can't remember. We had Shinsuke. Uh, we had a uh, six-man tag. Indy. I think this is the fourth match. I think. Uh, to uh, yeah, it's in for you. Get your head back into wrestling game, girl. <laughs> Cole, telling it as it is. Love it. Uh, Cole, I can't right now. I can't watch for it, so it's hard to get my head back into wrestling game if I can't see it. Just watch some wrestling on YouTube and pretend that you're watching Raw. <laughs> Chad Gable says Jesse. I know. I see all. Uh, Irish Rebel, you know the song I sent you. Cynthia, even uh, even you saying the word Raw is me suspicious about reading your coins. <laughs> she she goes Raw, my friend. She goes in Raw. I'm only here on days as now. Left Tazzy's stream. For Raw, got bored, too busy talking to each other and are in the chat. Only here and it's a Tazzy's just got bored. Ah, oh, it's Tazzy doing it. Who's on Tazzy's stream? Who does it with Tazzy? If they're just talking between themselves and not bothering with the chat, there's no point in watching. That them kind of YouTubers don't really. They're not watch alongs. They're just two people talking and not engaging got to engage with the chat or there's no point of the chat you might as well just go live and forget the chat there's some bigger youtubers what do that it's not for me the chat is you guys are the fuel without you I'm this this becomes boring I'm just staring at a camera thinking god will somebody say something we said this chat tonight is with we, this is the lowest it's been and we're at 11 people in the chat right now we got up to 23 the first hour before even the show started literally we had loads of people it was amazing Tazzy, Shane, Jody, Coaster now Joe because of the howdy tees Days doesn't even read super chats or oh, very rarely uh, he does if he remembers. Days is right. Days, the first hour of Days' stream is just Days talking by himself, and he says the same thing over and over again. If you watch a video, he literally repeats it again and again and again, and it's like Days shut up and read the chat. Uh, I don't really associate myself with the insiders that much. I'm not a Tazzy fan. I, I'm. I never will be. Joe D is too far up the Bray stuff's ass, and their content is just Bray. Anything Bray and it's Bray, Bray, Bray. It's just too much for me. I can't do with it. Uh, Coaster don't like him. They're just not likable people, to be quite honest with you. Joe and Jeff, I, I I like Jeff. Jeff is the only one out the insiders I actually give a shit about, and that's that's where I'm at. If Jeff were doing a stream by himself, I'd be in. That's that's where I'm at. I watch wrestling on YouTube. I would have to leave the stream. Yeah, I know you would. Oh, fuck off, man. <laughs> Am I kidding? I don't understand when Days sleeps. He's uh, streaming since basically Friday smack now. He sleeps during the day and he stays awake over the night time, which is weird to me. I swear to anybody, I couldn't do that. Not on a regular, but it does. Peacock. Backlash from France. Uh, he does read them. It just takes him forever to get to them all. Yep. I don't think Day sleeps, to be honest. He's not exactly doing wonders for his uh, lifespan. Never heard of Tazzy. DJ, uh, you, know, you don't want to. 
I'm not going to be here selling him. Not a fan. I, I used to like him. And then he, he got bitter, started blocking me on shit. So it's like, fuck off. When, when people start doing that, I haven't blocked anybody and I won't block people. But when you start doing that, it were all that C wrestling's fault. <laughs> not that. That was my problem. Uh, James, even apologise or not get into them. Yes, OMG, Seamus, please. Was that just the vignette of Seamus? So, Chad has got Vinci, takes him down, nice leg dr uh, takedown. Pro, uh, proper uh, 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 collegiate wrestling move. Obviously, people want a Chad Gable to be that. So, was that Seamus Pro? Oh, I missed it. Seamus coming back, cool. Probably coming back. Is he coming back to Raw or SmackDown now? Is a question. He'll be a part of the draft, I would have thought. And bar on Vinci, Chad, real big. Uh, well, he's just great wrestler, very underrated fella. We need Ginger versus Ginger. We need a Sheamus to finally get that IC match of <laughs> Sami Zayn versus Sheamus. Dave has blocked my comment yet again. <laughs> yep, you're too rude for YouTube. Too rude for YouTube. There we go. We need to the final hour, guys. Three o'clock in the morning. Uh, I like being. I like. I like being in Raw. The Irish Rebel. Come on. When was the last time you went in Raw? Be honest. When was the last time you had... When was the last time you drank from the Fairy Cup? <laughs> when was the last time you visit a Lady Garden? Oh, I was such a nip of a boy. <laughs> uh, Ludwig gets tossed over. By Chad, tag in to Sami Zayn. Sami down, axe angle into uh, Ludwig. Sami up top, nice elbow. Slaps. Gunther's having a break actually. Gunther will be away from TV for a while. Repackaging him, regurgitating him. I mean, he's had 666 days as champ. He deserves, deserves a break. So his lackeys are back on TV. I like going in raw as well. <laughs> it feels amazing. Uh, Brian Alvarez is slowly turning back to praising WWE, and you can see him, uh, Meltzer nearly crying. Tuna Meltzer. Chad is tagged. Goes up top. Off the top rope, down splash. Takes out Imperium. So, great tag team match. The, the little matches that we've had tonight have been pretty good. Felt a bit flat in places. The pacing again of this show has not been great. But the segments have. We've had quite a lot tonight. Just the pacing's been a bit off for me. Uh, but someone were, uh, but if someone were to go in raw, possibly me getting pregnant and getting to hold for another baby. <laughs> You've heard of the after pill, right? You've heard of diaphragms, right? Why would you need to get pregnant, right? Come on, Cynthia, you're old enough now to get the snip. <laughs> oh, I do like Jim Cornette. Meltzer is a haunt. <laughs> Keep... <laughs> James keeping it clean, what the fuck? Jeez, kept it clean. <laughs> Jim Cornette is the real final boss. Jim Cornette's legend. Old school manager 
promoter. I would never abort a child, babe. No, not abort a child. After pill. So then that day after pill, you have sex, you have a pill the day after. That's not aborting a child. That's just stopping getting pregnant. Putting a, a diaphragm in is stopping the sperm getting up your uterus. What, what, what? <laughs> you religious people make me laugh. Oh no, we can't do that. What the fuck? Same for you being in raw. It like makes me feel like a woman. <laughs> uh, Irish Red Bull likes being taken in raw. <laughs> he told me. Uh, Jesus, same for you. Go and deal with yourself and come back when you are done. <laughs> Call. High five, brother. High five. <laughs> Uh, Cynthia, I wouldn't either, but I'm going through the change. She's going through the menopause. Menopause! Damn, too much information. <laughs> Heft them kids. Oh, yeah, that is way too much information there, ever. Respect. <laughs> Oh, this our chat always discusses self, doesn't it? Oh, I can't believe I put double fucking curses. That's not good. I'm going to change it now, and this match will be over by the time we come back from a commercial break. Boom. Boom. We'll take it down. Buff. Da -da -da -da. Get a fast charger. Get a faster charger. I don't want kids at all, says Irish Roll. You're too old for kids anyway. You're 53 years old. You're old fart. What? You fathering a child right now would be ridiculous. Mate, your sperm is past it. Mate, your sperm has got a simmer frame and walking sticks. It'd have taken like 500 years to get to the egg. <laughs> They'd run out of puff halfway through. They'd be t they'd be taking a nap. Oh, Larry, we can't move any further. We need to take a rest. Oh, yeah, I know. We'd have to, have to take a quick nap. <laughs> Granddad napping it. You've no chance, Paul. Uh, do you like the Fast and Furious movies? Ah, uh, give or take them. They're right. some of them are alright. Some of them are shite. But uh, they're all right. They're they're not my fast cars and shit like that. Not my cup of tea. But mm, they're all right. Uh, uh, dear, I feel bad for you. I am a dinosaur in the chat. I am fifty one, so I am past due. <laughs> Sometimes I think I'm a X rated stream instead of wrestling stream. <laughs> Big hunter. Welcome to Dave in real life. <laughs> I can feel the hot flushes from the other side of the Atlantic. Look, we, we I allow it because it's fun. If we get distracted, it just gets things a little bit better. 49, more like 600. <laughs> Sports, horror, conspiracy, I wonder myself sometimes. I'm 43 years old, I've still got it. But I'm getting hot flushes and stuff, I know it's coming. Oh my god, we're getting counselling sessions on flipping women f f changes. <laughs> now, this is a conversation that I really don't want. The Stephen's just going to lighten up the mood. It's going to change the subject. Natalia's up. <laughs> well done. Uh, Dave, I know. I know, right? Sperm takes a break. It's going to have a lay down here. We'll get there eventually. It's not going anywhere. You're almost welcome, ever. <laughs> Chad, Ed, but from the top, a la Benoit. But we're not about to say that because that would be wrong. Shoosh. Nice spinning net breaker there, though. That was cool. How great. Chad looks amazing in this matchup. Chad versus Sammy, anyone? I see title on the line. Kick Chad gets put up by Vinci. Vinci into the corner. There was a blind tag. 
Ludwig kick to the face of Chad. Take us down. Nice spin off the top. One, two, three. Don't quite win. Kick out. And there is Sammy. It's a two. It was great. <laughs> he nearly didn't get there, by the way. And uh, Gable actually did push uh, Vinci off. Uh, 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 Ludwig off, sorry. Haven't got through it exactly just yet. But hopefully I can survive it. Dave, I'm 51. Going on 52. I'm, I'm old, mate. You are old. Austin316 is here. What did you think of Monday Night Raw so far, dude? Hope you're well. And where where were you at WrestleMania? I wanted the glass to break. You wasn't there. You let us down. Undertaker saved your ass. What have you got to say for yourself? <laughs> I'm only kidding, dude, I know. Uh, dude, Dave, you can believe people are being salty about Roman losing at WrestleMania. I don't get it. <laughs> People are sorry about Roman losing. No, what they don't like the story finishing. Roman's done a fantastic job. Uh, there's no salt there for me. It's just good stuff. Nothing wrong with not wanting kids Irish, but when you are ready to be in a relationship, you make sure you don't have a woman who has a kid or kids. Uh, don't start ever. Ha ha ha. Uh, Dave, it's Seamus returning. Yes, there was a video thing. I think I missed it, but I'll believe the chat. Undertaker took out, so it took me out before I could come out. <laughs> I thought he saved your ass. But you were uh, too busy celebrating beer day. <laughs> you good ever? Right, you guys are awesome. Exploder into the corner goes uh, Vinci. Luba kick. Think for I'm not too hold. Whoopee. Chad has tagged in. He's tagged him in instead of doing the Aluma He's going to do the Aluma kick anyway. He's hit the Aluma kick. Chad gets in, but he sends him over. Up he goes. Ah! <laughs> nice suplex. One, two, three. German bridge. Shoosh. Yes, please. There you go, Chad and Sammy looking great together. Good combination. I bet Undertaker was under the ring at the start of the match. Back two, there was somebody under the ring. Imagine if it was Taker. <coughs> Amazing. I was surprised to see Undertaker instead of Stone Cold. Yeah, I think everybody was. I don't know what the reason behind that was because the it was. I'm sure Triple H was just trolling people when he sent out a tweet exactly 316 uh, I think he was trolling everybody but it should have been Stone Cold right it should have been him I don't know what the reason why he wasn't there but obviously it kind of then made sense that it would be Undertaker he's the leader of the locker room obviously he's there because of the Dead Man show it made sense, but I do think Undertaker seemed to be drafted in at the last minute. I mean, I don't know how true that is. Surely it'll start unravelling this week the truth of why Stone Cold wasn't there. Roman made that title mean something again. He did. We should be grateful to Roman Heyman and the Bloodline, the best storyline in years. Yep. Totally. <coughs> There's Jay. Yeet. <coughs> Yut. Yeet down. Fatal Four Way is the mates tonight's main event. Undertaker looked autumn last night. Oh, nope. Believe it or not, no one. Uh, or not, not your namesake was actually sick over WrestleMania weekend. Uh, oh, was he sick? Was uh, Stone Cold sick? Yeet! There's Ricochet, Samantha. Ah, uh, Andrade. There's Ava. 
and Dirk Nicaldis. So there are all the three general managers. Obviously, draw the draft. The draft, that is what they're there for, right? I did suggesting that Austin appearing would have been taken to much limelight away from Cody. Silsy Green! I don't believe the rumour Seamus left WWE he might return on Raw. Yeet! Cole, you are. You can rest peacefully now. I am done talking for the night. But hey, how, but how meaningful could it be the Universal title be when it was only about 10 years old? Chelsea Green wants her moment tonight. Nia Jax. <laughs> So Chelsea Green's got a match up next. Who is she up against? They're all laughing. <laughs> it's it's going to be somebody from NXT or something, isn't it? Oops. Uh, it was great to see Undertaker being the dead man. Definitely work faster than sharper than Cynthia. Chelsea is so funny. Ha ha ha. Cynthia can be uh, with a woman. That has a, I could be with a woman as a child. I just don't want kids of my own. It's a fair point. I don't want any more kids. Uh, doesn't mean I wouldn't date somebody with kids. So if anyone in Casford is watching, <laughs> uh, I just want somebody local. I want somebody I can see in person every day. That's what I want. Uh, long distance relationships don't work too 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 stressful uh, I need to actually fit, be physical I like physical relationships not uh, text relationships uh, but that's just me uh, sorry I feel like uh, I I've, I've just pissed myself off I will call myself right off now. I've heated right up, right right now. Go and take a cold shower, Cynthia. I uh, thought Kane would have saved Cody Rhodes, but okay with the Undertaker. Kane wasn't there. I was quite surprised he was rumored to be there. I didn't see J Glenn Jacobs at all, which was a surprise. But that uh, is interesting. Very interesting. I don't go. Uh, I don't do long distance relationships either. Says Cynthia. That's a good thing to know. I like it when uh, me and you get physical in our relationship. <laughs> As is uh, spiritual. Austin three sixteen. It's very spiritual. We 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 zen together perfectly, and we can just feel each other's auras. <laughs> Uh, where you grab my aura is oh my god <laughs> I was like was in a long distance relationship for a while but it didn't work out uh, da -da 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 -da, Morgan revenge tour has begun the tackle rate she needed to finally she got the balls to do it <laughs> Liv is mid mid Morgan as, as I call it mid Morgan Mid Morgan. Definitely don't do anything on a first date, not even kiss. Oh god, she's so tight. She don't even pay. She doesn't even half pay. I, she made me pay for it all. Tight. Very tight. Uh hear you, <laughs> Cynthia, I hear you. But the last long distance relationship I was in was ultimately with my husband and I married him. Ever shout out to you. The true romantic true romantic uh, I don't care how good the date is I just don't, I just don't do it 
Uh, Cole says the Universal Championship, WWE Championship, will still be technically separated, t- separate titles. Roman was defending both titles at once under the banner of the Undisputed Championship. Well, that is great news. Separated now, though, aren't they? John Cena back for good now. No, he is back for a little while. He's got a final. This could be his final run. But definitely, because obviously he was at Mania. He was on this show because he's basically there. He did the Pat McAfee show as well earlier today before the show. Look at this. Sold out. Sold out. What is it? The sixth consecutive. No, seventh, eighth, ninth, eighth, ninth. Milwaukee was sell out. Eleventh, Chicago. Philadelphia, 14, 15, 16, 17, 17 consecutive sellouts. And WWE is dead, guys. It's dead. <laughs> Unbelievable. They should have given Cody a new title tonight because that having the world heavyweight title means it's now actually disputed. You are correct, they might do it eventually. Give them time. Draft three weeks away. Raw Monday, April 29th. But on the April 26th is first. We going through the stadium again. Last time I ever told someone how I felt about them, my heart was shattered. They were long distance, I couldn't do it. They needed time and space to heal. I needed time and space to heal. It's Chelsea Green. Going bowling with Hulk Hogan, says the sign. Let's hear it. Chelsea Green. Love that. Fucking love that. That is so good. Chelsea Green. <laughs> I love it. Oh, I've just deleted that for. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Here's V. Who, who is she up against? Uh, they're not separate. Cody was uh, introduced as undisputed champion. He was on. He was actually introduced as the undisputed universal WWE champion. That's what he was uh, announced as. Chelsea Green. Who was she up against? I am nervous to be in another relationship. I don't think I want to be in one right now. I can't do another heartache. It's Jade Cargill. OMG Oh my god It's the perfect storm Chelsea Green biting off more than she can chew <laughs> Jay Cargill making her raw debut Look at this girl Take a look at this girl. Irish Rebel. There you go, my friend. <laughs> it's me, Jade. Did not think of her. But here she is, a Jade Cargo. Uh, thank you, Cole. After losing my husband almost three years ago don't think my heart can handle another break. Chelsea 100% wins. Yeah, easy. Absolute easy. <laughs> oh my god. There she is, Jade Cargo looking. Just looking absolute fire. Irish is already doing, doing it, Dave. He's already doing that, Dave. <laughs> Chelsea is dead. 
She's not happy. Look at her. She's not happy. That is my point, though. The WWE Universal is undisputed title. So now, technically, we have three world titles, including the Heavyweight Championship. Yeah, it's just an elongated name. It's actually just one title. I'm sure in time they'll just strip these extra names off. Big kick, kick to uh, Chelsea Green. This is going to be over. This is a. This is not a fast match. Look at Chelsea's face. She is so good, though, man. Long distance relationships are the worst, because you never know if you are being unfaithful. There is the kiss, the lick. It's over. That did not last long. A lot of them wished they looked like Jade. <laughs> a lot of men wished. Oh God, she's 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 just too much. <laughs> a lot of men would wish they looked like Chelsea Green. <laughs> just saying. I love Chelsea. She's great. Great raw debut for that lady right there. The storm has hit WWE. And Karen is not happy. She wants to see the management. This past weekend we're back. With Stephanie McMahon. WrestleMania. Keep looking back at the highlights of that epic epic Wrestlemania 40 which we're still reeling from got a fatal 4 way match there's Bailey. oh I did actually like the EO entrance I've got to admit it haha <laughs> TK but Jade in squashes for two years tonight Bailey got her revenge she Hulk wins she Hulk don't quite work. I, I'm trying to find a way of getting that to work. Wonder Woman works. It Wonder Woman, but She Hulk doesn't quite. They can't really do the same. So I, I, it's getting the She Hulk. It doesn't work. Oh, look at the guys at the back. There's Chad. This is I want to notice. And that the the pretty lady. Hello, pretty lady. They're all leaving now. The extras. There's a fork truck driver in the back. Had that match won, I handed it to you on the server pack. There's this little like, r uh, friendly rivalry between these two. Match next week, anyone? There you go, Sammy giving Chad the chance. I wished I looked like Shania Twain. Man, you feel like a woman. <laughs> this would make you all happy I'm not here tomorrow in, of course, I don't do NXT. Oh no, Cynthia. Irish needs his Wonder Woman. You can't leave us. You should never leave us. Drew McIntyre with new graphics. Is that new graphics or have I just like totally missed it? It, it is new. New look, Drew. It's a new look, Drew. Look at him. It's new look, Drew. He looks mean. He looks nasty. It means business. This fatal four way match. It is your night's uh, main event. Unless we have CM Punk, of course. Fatal 4-Way. I'm just going to put Fatal 4-Way. Because I can't be asked writing all the names. Last night happened. Last night was complete and utter BS. Five minutes. It was five minutes, not six, like I was saying. <laughs> to be here in the chat. I feel like a woman. Oh, I'm no one's Wonder Woman, Dave. You are. Wonder why you're a woman. Ah, <laughs> I'm joking. I'm joking. I'm joking. I'm joking. Same for you. You're much loved. You are. 
Irish Rebel loves you. Everyone in the chat loves you. Are oh, you kidding? You are a ledge. You're a ledge. You you could stay and chat to us all. You don't need to watch NXT. I don't even know if I'm doing it yet. The stream's up, but if I don't feel up to it, because I do need sleep, I might not do it. Depends on how I am. I'd wipe your ass for you, but you'd probably enjoy that. He's angry at CM Punk, obviously. Oh, priest, you stole that from me, priest. Clash at the castle, anyone? That prick CM Punk. Let's go, Jew is proper swearing. CM Punk, CM Punk. He said he caused it, but you got in Punk's face, Drew. You got in his face, you made it personal. You caused this. You took your height off the prize. Shaquem says, new name. Has he got a new name? Is it just Drew now? It's got new graphics. He deserved it, man. You called him an F. Uh, no, Irish Jade is your Wonder Woman. I am your wondering if I belong in anything. I don't feel like I am. Cynthia, come on. Stop this. You stop this self stuff. It's kind of, it's like, come on. Here comes Yeet. Here comes Jay to soften the mood. Cynthia, just you're a great girl. Stop being like that. You are a lovely lass. Yeet. Number one contender, fatal four-way match, Ricochet, Jay Uso, Drew McIntyre, Big Johnson Reed. Drew's losing it outside. He's proper furious. Look at this. Look at J J Jay's own this weekend. Look at that crowd. Hello, number one contendership for the World Heavyweight Championship. Who is going to chase down a priest? Main event, Jay. Down since day one ish, uh, down since day one ish. Thank you. I don't don't feel like that right now. I appreciate it. Look, people, we have knockbacks. Uh, that's just life. You know what I mean. I, I've had my fair few. Uh, I've had people reject me a thousand times over, and that's just how it is. You, you, you rake it off, you rake it off, you get on off your feet. You, right, you allowed yourself to feel. I mean, you're talking about that long distance relationship. You allowed yourself to feel. Why, why do you feel bad about that? Why are you feeling bad about that? Embrace that and find somebody what's... What is... Uh, closer to you. Can I say that closer to you? Put your hopes into one person. Mm. I don't know, man. Don't know. But same for you. You are a great person. Never doubted you being a great person. David is your Superman. You will find your new Superman when you are ready. When it's the right Superman. Oh, it's a lovely statement. David was my Superman. I was his Wonder Woman. Oh, now he's gone and I'm alone. 
He's still Wonder Woman to David. He'll always be that. How fit in Philly is where Bray returned at Extreme Rules. Now Philly is the start of the bow. Uncle Howdy return. Have we seen Audi? Have I missed anything tonight? <clears throat> so I feel like I'm missing all this Uncle Audi stuff. Have I missed Uncle Audi? When when is he has he had a thing on? Have I completely brushed past it? I mean, we had the thing before the show, which we didn't see here in the UK. Has there been stuff after that? So I'm lost. <laughs> I'm proper lost. Man, please explain. <laughs> Don't feel bad uh, for confessing. Uh, I wasn't going to. Good. It's just, where you writing stuff in the chat, though? Feels like you are. You're like, I'm alone, I'm this and that. It's like, Neh. stop that. Uh, you can't let shit bring you down. The only person it destroys is yourself. Got to look after number one facts. Cole, see, Cole gets it. Cole, shout out to you, my friend. Cynthia, you are. You see, look, the the chat is telling you what you need to hear. Listen to the chat. Glitch in the Bronson Reed back. Seat. Was it? It was that a glitch? What was that glitch? Was that an Uncle Howdy face then? Oh, Shakim has actually shared something with me. Is that the glitch? I mean, I saw the glitch, but didn't see what was in the glitch. Uh, I haven't seen Uncle Howdy teasers tonight. Oh, well. Okay, Shakim has gone one extra. I mean, <laughs> this is what Shakim thinks the glitch is. Kathy Kelly looking at Swish. Hello. Oh, uh, right, you sent me the Bray White video. I haven't really, I don't really mess around with social media while I'm live, to be to be honest. But uh, Uncle Howdy is trending. Haven't seen any Uncle Howdy stuff. Uncle Howdy just played in the arena for 30 seconds. So it's been played in the arena. The Uncle Howdy tease. Okay, so they got it in the arena. Okay, that's cool. That'll be unseen. <laughs> yeah, they played a tea. Oh, there. Bronson Reed. I don't know how much you can see of that. I don't know if that is anything. That was during the Bronson Reed thing. can't see anything in that but I'm sure somebody will render it there you go I'm sure there'll be some breakdown videos from wrestling days because I'm sure he'll get his teeth into that uh, Cody going to smack down after the draft haven't seen any uncarly stuff Jimmy Uso is my superman but he, he just doesn't know it yet. And you've got to get past uh, tr uh, tr uh, Trinity Fatou first. Good luck. <laughs> Cynthia, I know how you feel about Jimmy. Oh, damn right, Irish. Next week, Andrade versus Dominic Mysterio. Andrade Sami Zayn versus Chad I'm not live next week unfortunately but oh, I wish I was that match looks good I uh, have a horrible feeling that Uncle Howdy will get nostalgia pop for Bray but how long it will last unfortunately Bo Dallas is not Bray Wyatt uh, and that's the truth yeah but if uh, it depends on the direction they take it Bronson Reed is on his way who had that glitch? Uh, down since day one ish. Naomi can tag along and play. <laughs> play it is, uh, there he is, the Andre Battle Royal winner. That's, that's his tag now. It's a big fella. Uh, 
So the last one to come out is obviously Ricochet. So my Varian gonna totally enjoy this. Who's winning the Fatal 4 way for the number one contender match? I think it might swerve us and Jay wins it. Well, we're right at the end of the show. We were promised a promo from uh, CM Punk. Maybe he just shows up in this. Dave, do you think that Uncle Howdy will go do a funhouse? No. I don't think they do the funhouse. I think it would be a mistake. I say do the Uncle Howdy stuff and leave the Bray stuff alone. The Uncle Howdy stuff I was Bo Dallas anyway. So I I can respect that. Leave the Bray stuff to Bray. Uncle Howdy was Bo Dallas. So that I, I believe can continue. Ricochet is here. Uh, May the event of Monday Night Raw, Ricochet. <laughs> Honestly, you can tell with the, 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 the chat, right? At the start of this stream, we were hitting 20 plus people. We've now down to seven people. It, it is like date gauging the room. Fatal four way rules. There is no rules. Pinfall, submission, number one contendership. Who faces Damien Priest at Backlash? It's got to be Drew McIntyre, hasn't it? Uh, Jay goes over the top. He's heavily strapped. Remember, he went through the uh, table on the uh, uh, entrance ramp, ramp at Financial Field. Here comes Ricochet. Ah, nice. Takes out all of them. Boom, look at these camera angles. Awesome. I agree with you 100% Dave about Bray and Bo. Can't blur the lines between the two. No. Fun House was Bray. Uncle Howdy is Bo Dallas. And that's the way to continue the legacy. And don't bring back Alexa Bliss <laughs> with that stupid Lily doll. Seven people at three forty-three. Uh, to be honest, better than not. I ain't no, no. no. I, I'm not dissing it. It's just gauging the show and how people switch. It's how the the ratings work as well. People hyped at the beginning. Not so much now. We've got eleven people in the chat now, so I, I, I'll say it again. <laughs> It's cool though, I'm loving it. Everybody is awesome. Uh, never been in a free some before. When it comes down uh, to Jimmy, I will sacrifice it. <sighs> There'd be some people saying they've never been in a two some before. <laughs> like this naughty side of you. Irish Rebel gets too saucy. I, 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 I hate to think what you two talk about. Cynthia and Irish have the craziest of conversations, I am sure. Filth. Pure filth. Cynthia's at it again. She's she she is she's like it all the time, Cole. Be careful, she'll be after you next, mate. <laughs> I'm only kidding, I am joking. Sophia's a great person. She's uh, she's a f loyal friend. I give her an hard time. She gives me an hard time. That's what we do. But no, form of respect. Honestly, Sophia, honestly, when it comes to your stepdad, please, if you need a here to bend, you know where to find me. We talk about you, Bailey and her big butt trousers. I can see why you talk about Bailey, but why talk about me? Don't talk about me, talk to me. <sighs> I'm swinging around because I am uh, trying to stay, uh, my, my feet are hurting. 
Uh, whatever Dave dishes out, I fire back. Yeah, honestly, Cole, right? If you'd have been in the stream last night, night two WrestleMania, I'm a big Bailey fan, so I was getting proper like emotion over Bailey winning. Um, Irish Rebel and Cynthia, literally, were kicking my ass in the chat, putting me under pressure. Oh look, Dave's staring at Bailey in her butt trousers. Oh my god, Dave's gonna come. Blah blah blah. Oh, Cole says he's spoken for. Ah. Oh, that's awesome, dude. Awesome. Yeah, you see, people, we've got people in relationships in the chat, yeah. <laughs> I'm just not allowed in uh, uh, in bed tonight because I have to come I have to come carve in and wake her up every time I get get up to check the cows are you on a farm it's interesting you, you've you got a farm there Cole well, that's interesting you've got you, so you run a farm uh, Dave you will never know about me and Cynthia don't wanna I can't imagine what you two get up to Cynthia's told me that you're just a pervert. Dirty, mo dirty old man. Oh, come for Ed, but wait, next week, Raw is coming from Montreal. Uh, Carl, I'm not, a, no, nobody's calling you a slut. Cows can't carving. So, what, oh, right, right. So, what, what? The slaughterhouse? Carvery? I don't know. <laughs> You're cooking cows. Cow, cows can't. Like, what? Just simplify it for me because I'm thick. Uh, so, I don't. After married, married or people who are in relationship, I don't do that. Dave, you should talk about perving. Yeah. <laughs> Me, I don't perv. Yeah, I'm a father. That's a farmer. That's why I have cows in my profile picture. I just thought you were fast. I, I thought you were just into cows, which is quite a normal fetish in Scotland. Welsh people are into sheep. Just thought Scots were into cows. It's just that's what I thought <laughs> no it's alright no it's cool being a farmer that's alright mate that's cool nice what well, uh, so you've got ca cows you've got pigs you've got chickens uh, you've got some horses what, what you've got what have you got on your farm mate what you got on your farm old MacDonald had a farm he called him Colin <laughs> oh mate oh, I'm joking with a wick wick there and a chick chick there everywhere a chick chick <laughs> oh my god I, I love it mate no I'm only I'm only joking I think it's great love the fact that you're keeping it keeping it old school farmers it's, it's just not enough these days especially here in the UK it's uh, good to see uh, very cool Carl do you sell chicken eggs and or milk uh, Dave, you are always perving over Bailey. I'm not perving over Bailey. I just like Bailey. You guys suggest that I'm perving over her. I don't even mention her. She's not even anywhere on the screen right now. <laughs> not me. No, I'm no perv. Uh, lamb and beef. Cynthia uh, sell lambs, calves to other farms. Uh, fatten them up for eating. Oh, just cows and sheep. Okay, uh, maybe dirty old man, but I still got it. Because I'm iconic. Still got it, have you? Oh, it's them white vests. <laughs> it's nice wherever you're from. Uh, where you at? Uh, would love to buy some from you, for sure. He fattens them up. Fattens them up and sells them to other farmers, and then they cut them up and eat them. <laughs> Uh, talking about big booty butch houses bull on an island called Col on an island called Col 
Bailey is fit to be on it. To be fair, yes, yeah, she is, isn't she? Look at her. Seth thinks so as well, and she's next to Rhea. Fit, fit, fit. She's my future wife. Sidney doesn't like that, but she is. <laughs> we are into the last ten minutes of Raw. Finally. Feels like this stream's gone on forever. Ever. Three, uh, f three hours, 47 minutes I've been live for tonight. And you've put into contents we were alive for six hours yesterday. Saturday was six hours and then there was a further two, three hours were stand and deliver. It's too long, man. It's too long. But we might do NXT. I'll leave that stream up and I'll let you know if I'm still doing it or not. I probably will do. Can't see why I can't. If I've done tonight, I might as well do tomorrow night. Can't do Wednesday. We don't do Wednesday anyway. We do do AEW. We don't do TNA, but we will be back for SmackDown anyway. I can't do it anyway because I'm at work. Work, man. Oh, man, I wish I could. But I can't imagine how much it would cost to send me here. It Send it here to you know, like, go through quarantine and shit like that, wouldn't it? Google Cal, Cal Beaches. That's where I live. Our beaches at Ace. All right, cool. Keep calling you Col, even though that's just the place where you're from. So, what's your real name? Or is it Colin? I don't know. I, just, I want I want to call you your real name, or what do you prefer me to call you? So I can only go on what your uh, profile name is. I think I am jealous of your precious. Do you think I am jealous of your precious Bailey? No. Why would you be jealous of precious Bailey? Jeez. Why, man? Uh, not done yet. Got NXT tomorrow. Yeah, well, let's see if I do it. It depends on if I'm tired. I've got a busy day tomorrow, so I'm playing that by ear. If if I feel up to it, we'll do it. It's NXT, innit? Uh, I've got to make a confession. I really master Yoshi from Jack and Paul. Rick Hunter, I knew it, man. Hey, he's, my name's Johnny. All right, Johnny, I can call you Johnny now. Instead of Col, keep calling you Colin, it's not your name. <laughs> Johnny. Johnny Five is alive. Had to do that, sorry. But Johnny, hello. Who is Johnny? Uh, I love Dragon Ball. Obviously, if you get the reference, I'm singing Short Circuit. We've got some slaps. These two beefy men. Oh, Bronson squishes him in the corner. We've ignored this fatal four way, by the way. It's a cat be asked. Bronson reads this up. Drew McIntyre scoops him up, plants him down. Drew goes for the pin. Saved by Jay. Yeet! A pervy sage. Same for you. I love Mario and Luigi. What's that about? Hey, Mario. Can't get jealous over. You can't. I can't. I can't get jealous over anyone. They're all starting to beat up Drew. Super kicks to Drew, taking him out of the equation, and then to super kick to Bronson, who. Oh, Jay t kicks to uh, Ricochet. These two are fast. Clothesline takes down Ricochet. Jay takes down Bronson. Drew McIntyre safe. This is a good little match, actually. I'm sure we should pay attention to this one. Never gotten jealous over anyone in my life. I do love S me some Johnny Depp, Keanu Reeves. Never had a short, never had a short circuit <laughs> reference before. It's usually here's Johnny. I'm old school, mate. Though I am old school, but hey, here's Johnny's good as well, though, isn't it? <laughs> They're shining. Well, they we're here to make a difference. 
It popped into my head when I saw Johnny. Johnny Five is alive. I thought that were better than here's Johnny. I love short circuit as a kid. There you go. Old school. Love it. Keep it old school, my friend. If you want old school references like that, this is the place. I am. A, I love films. I'm a film buff. I did have a movie channel at one point. Drew gets uh, caught on the top. As long as you ain't an arsehole like the last Johnny we had here. Oh no, uh, we don't talk about that guy. He he was he he used his autism as a way of being a dick. Don't like that. You seem a nice guy, so you're more than welcome. Please make sure that you join the streams regular, watch the videos, do videos all the time, and uh, all that good stuff. I like Karate Kid movie, which one though, Steve? And the 80s or the new one? If you say the new one, get out of my chat. <laughs> We're kidding. I'm not. It's, it's either Ralph Macchio or No Way. Yeah, Karate Kid's great, but the new one was shit. They're trying to do a new one though, aren't they? They've asked, uh, they're looking for the new Karate Kid. Ralph Macchio and Jackie Chan. Bronson takes out Drew. Bronson looks beast in this. Did they, they're not going to do Bronson though, surely. Oh, I can, I can be an arsehole if I need to be. Johnny don't need to be mate. We just have a laugh, right? We we just have a laugh on here. We we, we if you take things serious in here, <laughs> you don't need to. We're just having a laugh. We it's jokes. I am a man who, I am a man who will fight for your honor. I'll be the hero you've been dreaming of. We live forever. Together forever we do, 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 do for the glory of love. Sang that for you, Cynthia. <laughs> <laughs> People are saving the show. People are saying the show has been terrible. It's not been terrible. It has been boring at stages, though. Oh, love that splash. Oh, I think Ricochet's got hurt in the process, though. Straight up. The, one of the sides of the uh, announce table hit him into the stomach. Holy shit. Look at this. Just watch. I mean, that's a 360. And then he, he hits the side. He, he, look at this. This is brutal, man. And he hits the, the actual side of the... Uh, uh, announce desk straight in his ribs he, he's in pain he's probably broke a rib there uh, no joke as well no, he's probably actually this is awesome this has been awesome this has been a good little pe uh, end of uh, end of match I don't know what other people were wanting to watch Drew's going to get the victory I can guarantee you that I used to be a Dragon Balls Dragon Balls I'm going to change my name to Rick Hunter. <laughs> Shout out to you, Rick Bronson. It's absolute bear. Dave Bullcrap. <laughs> Cynthia. Hey, CM Punk. Two times CM Punk. <laughs> Yeet. CM Punk making himself. Oh, nice spear bite. Oh, it might even be Jay. Come on, Jay. Let's go. There is the frog splash. One, two, three. Punk has done it again, again, <laughs> again. Drew has been punked. <laughs> He's down since. Down day one ish. He's been down since day one ish. Punk under the ring. Ah! Good, good. The build in the feud between him and Drew. Ah, good fan. Get your scores in for Monday Night Raw. You know what? That was all right. That was good. You know that felt like a go home show, uh, a go home show, a Raw after Mania. That felt good. You've got Jade Cargill. You've got John Cena. Oh, it was good, man. That was good. 
Uh, it's been uh, terrible, but not at all. But it's been a raw aftermania quality, to be fair. Not being raw aftermania. Oh, okay, okay. Uh, Cynthia singing that Bailey Punk cost Drew the win. Uh, See, on Punk is really my life. <laughs> He's doing it on purpose, ever. He just knows he's just doing it against you. Jey Uso called it. So Jay is number one contender. But that was not the story. The story is CM Punk costing Drew McIntyre yet again. Uh, I'm now stronger than Goku. I am superhuman god, says Rick. Get your scores in, and uh, we're going to call it a night now, because I need to go to sleep. Sleep! They were playing Thursday night, Dave, yes, they play Atalanta in the Europa Liga. Maybe being a bit, uh, I'm maybe being a bit harsh. My score is, I says Shaquem. Brace yourself. You know what, no, uh, it's not an eight. Not, let's not go crazy. It's not an eight, but... Um, it's a se it's a it's a steady seven. Seven at best. You know what, I'm gonna give it a seven point five. That's where I'm at. I don't think it's been over impressive. But enjoyable. I've enjoyed it. It's been a laugh. And it's getting seven point five just because of the opening. The rock Cody promo at the beginning was fucking fire. 7.5 is where I'm at. Loved Goku, never anime person, but David got me into Dragon Ball Z. Dragon Balls. Don't, don't do anime. <laughs> I don't, I'm not interested in any of it. Used to watch Pokemon when I was a kid. 7 out of 5. How do you get 7 out of 5, Stephen? You are pushing numbers out of nothing now, dude. Alright. <laughs> You mean 7 out of 10, not 7 out of 5, dude. Uh, haven't watched Dragon Ball since he passed. Good stream, catch you all later. Thanks, uh, Johnny. Thanks for joining. Too sweet. No, you're a ledge, mate. mate. We'll probably live again tomorrow, if not Friday. Definitely back for SmackDown. More than welcome to join the live streams. Uh, hit that notification bell. Make sure that you know when I go live next. Don't do Raw and SmackDown every week because of work commitments, but... Every other week we'll be live. You'll 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 know. You'll get used to it. But it's been an epic weekend. Uh, we we're winding down now. Uh, five out of ten says Shakim. Uh, have uh, have a great night. It sounds like you're gonna. Uh, you're gonna. It sounds like you're gonna have uh, Cindy. Great stream day. Thank you, Stephen. Seven out of five. <laughs> yes, yeah, seven out of five. I know. Johnny, don't worry about it, mate. It's a fella Scott. What can I say? <laughs> uh, Cynthia says, great stream tonight. Yeah, you're welcome, guys. You're welcome. Steve, I'm glad that you're not my accountant. <laughs> See, we have a laugh. See, this is the great, this is the, what the community brings. So, yeah, thank you, everybody what's watched. I'm going to go chill out now and go to bed and do all that stuff. I dream about Bailey and whatever else. Uh, thanks for stopping by. It's been good. It's been a blast. We've been treated to quite a good raw. It's not been a bad raw, not by any stretch. It's had quite a few NXT stars. No Trick Williams, which could they save him for SmackDown? Don't know. SmackDown After Mania is next. Obviously NXT tomorrow night. If I am live, I should be. But who knows? Anyway, I'll see you all later. I've been David Real Life. You guys have been awesome. Till the next time. Uh, bye for now. Love you guys. You're amazing. Bye.